What's good? What's good, everybody? It's Sunday, it's Sunday. We're back again with another stream, you know. Sports fan, welcome to the stream, man. What's good? How's your day? Uh, pretty okay so far, you know. Demi God, welcome to the stream, bro. My game keeps turning off. Tell you what, Demi God, try playing a different game and see what happens. Because it could be the angler, and it could be like the PlayStation itself, you know. Mr. Mobile, welcome to the stream, man. So, guys, we're here today again, Fishing Planet, and I might be going to a map that, uh, <laughs> yeah, you guys won't expect me to go to. But because I have the rods with me and the, the gears, well, baits and so on, <clears throat> I think I'm taking a walk there, you know. I might not be there for a long day, but we're gonna go there. David, welcome to the stream, man. What's good? Let me check some things if we have enough. I think I can remove this rod to get the jig winner. Yeah, I'm ahead to a map that, uh, I don't like and I don't recommend it but you know for something different let's head there so how is the all day going so far man or night you know just give me a few minutes guys let me get some things ready To be honest, I was kind of debating on what I should play today. I did make a community post as well with uh, the Angler, Fish and Planet, and the Hunter, Call of the Wild. So far, Fish and Planet was the one that got the vote, so a majority wins, man. There we go. Dude, I just found something out. What's that? Did you find the problem of the game was causing it? Okay, we're good to go now, guys. We should be uh, on our way to the map. My game ke keeps turning off because they uh, know you're going to uh, call off uh, call off my fish. Nah, bro. No such thing. But definitely, you need to try some other games and to see what's the problem. You know. If it keeps turning off, it's a PlayStation. If it runs smooth on the harder games, it could be Call of Call of the Wild, bro. It has this past history of crashing games, you know, so be careful, man. But to be honest, I'm not sure it's the game like uh, the application. It might just be the entire console right there. It's called up the wild. Why you say so, man? Oh, my bad, mister. <laughs> Okay, uh, let's go fishing. The game I'm playing is lasting longer than Call of the Wild. Is the game overeaten or it's um, at a constant temperature right now? Xander, 
That's Tony's marker right there. Okay, just checking to see if I can recall what weather we, we fish at this map. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. No constant temperature. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on there, man. I mean, the other day we were playing, uh, playing Call of Duty, but the game turned off as well for you. So I can't say for sure, man. Let's change some baits for a minute. Okay. Hopefully I do have enough bait with me today. Do I have them? Crap, I think I don't have the baits I'm looking for. Nice. <laughs> really nice, man. Come on. Okay, I might have to head back home to get some baits I need. Darn it. Yeah, I need them shrimps. Well, I nothing planned, guys. So we're just here, winging it right now. And the, to be honest, it's not a map I recommend anyone to come to, unless you just want to be here for like a new fish, the experience-wise of going to a new map. This map is not worth grinding for any cash or XP. It's just you know, a map like that. Uh, where are you fishing at? I'm at Gent Turney's in right now. Hopefully I'm saying that right. A map, when I first started playing this game, it took me years to come here. So the thing is that my god, if I had a plan, if I had my plan to come here, I wouldn't have forget anything, right? But because this is just a, uh, you know, a random stream, random map, anything can go, bro. And yes, it's called being human. We, we all make mistakes, man. You got that right. Why is my audio so low, bro? Honestly, I would choose uh, Naren River over this map any day. Naren River is way better. Bass, catfish, gars, crappies. You got so many there you can go get, you know. This map, maybe the best thing on this map are, are like uh, the Zanders. Pretty much. But it's something different, you know? Okay, first fish in. Mr. Zander. Yes, sir. How many players are here? Three players. Oh, these these might be the competitor guys RFF and um RSF. Yeah, so they they might be here doing some type of practice or something. Might be practicing for a competition later. I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to just fish this map for a minute and then I might go to Naren River or Tiber River. Oh, 
Oh, I had a fish right there. Come on. I should be um, okay getting a unique Xander. The other uniques will take some time. I haven't finished fishing for all the fish in this map yet. I think I need like three more fish on this map to go. Then it's all finished, you know. Let me see something, by the way. Baits, first baits. Can I buy the shrimps here? No, you can't. Lovely. Yeah, we have to leave to get them. Those are one of the best baits to get fish on this map. The shrimps. Really good. You dropped it. Yep, that glitch is still in the game, bro. You go into the pause menu of fish bites, you come back. And it strikes over. That's still in the game, I see, huh? So when I was playing this game, there are a few maps I just never really go to because they weren't worth it. Uh, Lesson Villa, Mudwater River, I've been there. That's the one way it wasn't a good map to go to. I didn't go to Narin River either. Because the fish there were too big to even keep. To put in a keep net, so that was a waste of time right there. Uh, Gen, this place did not give any XP or cash. No matter what size unit you get, it wasn't worth it. Then I recently went back to Narin River now with a bigger net because I could keep the catfish there, the gars too. And I realized that, you know, it's not so bad for a low level map. So in my books right now, Narin River would stand above this map any day. yeah but you know you, you have to go to those map first to understand when i say they're not worth it you know some players might be like oh you talking smack they're really good maps when you go there you will realize you know that's based off my experience of playing them <coughs> Oh, at a fish right there. But yeah, Naran River pretty much got a bunch of trophies and uniques there. The crappies get big. The large mud bass, they don't reach unique size. But the small mud bass does. So you got some pretty big fish there, man. The catfish, they, uh, I don't think they're trophies. They're just regular ones, I think, if I'm not mistaken. The catfish at North Carolina is right by the truck, over to the right, if I'm not mistaken. That's one spot. They're by the, the rusty armor in the water, and they're in a few other spots as well. You got some dead sticks in the water and uh, I think some trees that they're under as well. So you got some few, you got a few plays with them there. Richard, welcome to the stream, man. What's good, bro? Let me change this for a minute. What game is this? Berkeley, welcome to the stream, man. Uh, we're playing Fishing Planet Simulator right now. And team, how is it going, bro? Welcome, man. Did you rank up uh, to level 20? Or are still grinding? You know what's crazy? 
I have some guides way back then that I haven't uploaded yet. So they're they're on YouTube, but I didn't make them public for this map. So for the unique flounder, I think for the uh, the, the heels too. But it was before they did the update where the pump and reel wasn't in the game. So that's the only reason why I haven't uploaded them. They were made before the uh, a few of the, the recent updates, you know. I'm doing good. Sorry I'm late. I was uh, eating. No, you good, bro. Taking our time. This map will be really slow today, you know. But I'm going to try my best to get some big ones to hit. I think I'm level 18 or 19. And how much cash we're talking about. So Richard, what's the plan today, man? You playing the angler or you taking a break? I was supposed to go hunting today, so I might have to do some hunting. Level 12? Wrong map, man. Wrong map. <laughs> and that's something they will not know unless they try it first. This is not the map this player should be at right now. But, you know, as I said, they won't know it unless they try it. Going after diamonds and uh, golden ridge. I need to get a lot more diamonds too as well, man. Just not so easy to get them all, you know. There you go. Mr. Xander. I need to leave to get some baits though guys. The what you call it, the shrimps. I need them. I'm trying to get them in order, but it's difficult. Tell me about it, man. I think you should just go for like you know, pick a few sets of diamonds and just go for them. And when you get first, you get first, you know, because you never know what's going to bite. Tell me about it. Been here for four days and only one diamond. <laughs> Man, all that time spent, I would just go play something else or do something else, you know. If you know the hassle of getting diamonds, bro, yeah, it's nothing fun, you know. Oh, he's just some exploring right now. I was at Falcon Lake, but I forget to upgrade my cute net. Oh, my days. Now we gotta spend some more cash. Tell, tell you what team. Before you leave. Get at least the cash to go back there. So spend a few days there with the 15 pounds that you have. Before leaving again. Or maybe you leave already. I don't know. I think I'm gonna do that man, uh, whatever diamond comes first, comes just, first comes just go fishing, I would go with the same thing bro, Hold on. Let, me, let me switch back this thing bro, this is not uh, working today. <coughs> Mm 
already been a slow map, you know? And yeah, I've been here for a few times, guys. It's not a new map to me. So I know what I'm doing is just things you do here just don't work like that, you know? I just go with the 8.8. .8. To 66 pound stringer. So, team, there is a thing with the stringer net, right? You can't release fish. So, if you keep a small fish and later on catch a big fish and you want to release it, you can't. So, you pretty much have to release the fish while it's in your hands, you know? So, right there, you might have to choose what fish you want to keep before you keep it. And, uh, Realistically, the, the the fish jail or the stringer kills the fish, but that is that's not in the game. Just realistically talking, you know. Atlantica, man, scaring all my fish right now, man. Come on, bro. Big ass cargo ship passing by, bro. It's getting all my fish. <laughs> Bruh. Come on. And he's onking too, bro. <clears throat> Come on, go for it. Why does that ship look like something from Stranded Deep? Looks similar to a, a sunken ship in Stranded Deep, man. What is the biggest pickup bass in Everglades? I think maybe around 8 pounds. Somewhere between like 8 and uh... Somewhere around that, man. I can't say for sure. I can check though. The big peacock bass are in Blue Crab Island and uh, the Amazonian Maze. Yeah, we need to get the shrimp and come back here guys. I think we're gonna go get them. Hopefully in the future they can fix the maps where you can go on the map if you're at high level max they will give you everything you need in the shop. They still got some limited stuff in the shop and you can't buy it like you can't buy the things you want because they're not there. <coughs> oh, let me see something. Let's see what how big these fish get here. Lychee, welcome to the stream. What's good? Uh, Everglades. Mr. Terra Tarpon. For me, I know that they're like eight point eight point something pounds, you know. But uh, let's see what's the biggest there. What am I doing? Oh, 9.9, .9, that's a 10 pounder right there. So they, they can get up to like 10 pounds if you put the decimal places where they should be, you know. So pretty nice big ones there. When did they get this big? Or oh, my fish were that small? <laughs> oh my days, 9 pounders are a lot bro. So they're not hard to come by. Respect from Poland. Welcome to the stream man. 
what's good and i appreciate you being here today you know uh let me go get my baits before we go back to the map and forget everything mr shrimps where you guys at there you go 81 shrimps i will get some more as well not that we need them but just for later on you know <clears throat> and we should be cooking. We should be ready to cook, man. There you go. Large minnows, duck must meat, two shrimps. Let's go back to the map, guys. Really, a cause of just looking up in the fishing plant, it says a pound at Everglades. Depending on the platform they base that, uh, Record on bro, it will be different. Different platforms got different records. They got the same max fish or big they get. For example, a shark is 450 pounds or <laughs> 440 pounds. That's the max weight for every platform right but when it comes down to the single biggest fish it will be different dry soap okay mister i don't know what kind of soap you're using but it's the wrong one <laughs> it's the wrong one man actually guys you know there is a monster fish here that we can also catch where is it This one, I have already got the bait. Wait, what? This had smuggled into peaceful European waters from faraway exotic uh, lands. The cannibal eel is now artlessly hunting down other eel. Oh damn. And decimating their population. This monster has to be stopped. You'll have to use a artificial lure. A fake lure? Or am I mixing that up wrong? That resembles the cannonball's favorite prey while making sure they arm no other eel. So it's like a, a fake bait of the real thing, you know? Because here you can't keep the eels from the water. Here's a tip. Try fishing near the bridge to catch the monster. The bridge. So if I'm, if I'm reading this right, the bridge is up there. So you need to get close to that bridge up top to get that uh, monster fish. We have the bait and everything, but I won't do the the mission. I won't do the mission without doing the that part of the mission, you know, just in case you guys want to see like the spots for the heel. Because I catch these fish randomly, and the bait is in my backpack, if not my own storage. Honestly, this thing was kind of dry, man. Ain't gonna lie. Let's keep trying it, though. I think I have the heel bait, so let me see if I have them with me. I won't do the mission, though. Mr. Andrew, welcome to the stream, bro. What's good? Okay, so the baits are in my backpack. At my home storage, you know. If I had them, I would have deleted the baits and recatched the heels for them. Oh, 
Oh, this one is passing by early. I check on mobile, it's all the same and all platform according to the dev told me. Nah. I mean you just saw for yourself mobile. Up to ten pound. Nine point nine is the biggest on console right now. So that information you got definitely outdated right there. Just just by the game not being cross play or cross platform you can tell. We got different uh servers right there. Yeah, what's good then we got? <coughs> okay, got the shrimps. If this day doesn't um click the way I want it to, we'll go to a different day. Been playing Fish and Planet with with Dell, but keep getting a uh, connection lost, so jumped off and rest the rest for the evening. Going to clean my fish tank and then chill with the wife. Third wedding wedding anniversary today. Congratulations, man! Well done, bro. Third anniversary today. And you said the game been crashing for you. Connection error. Hmm. Sometimes when you see stuff like that, could be something in the works, you know. I don't know, I'm not saying anything, but could be. Thinking positively, could be something in the works, like a update or something. <coughs> Did you say I was uh, trying to play the angler? Nah, I didn't say that, bro. I have not said that, my guy. <coughs> I would just uh, have a different game running in the background. To see if it's going to work for you, bro. <coughs> Just buy it already. Come on. Oh my Daisy dropped it. I think this map I think it's higher than Falcon Lake as well. Oh that's a nice eel right there. That's a nice eel. What will it be? That seems really massive. A unicar trophy. Trophy? What? And the shrimp or nah? Nope, duck must meet. Gotta be a flounder. <coughs> So where, where is Dell by the way? He said he was uh, going to be fishing for salmons in Connie Creek yesterday. I wonder how that went for him. <coughs> we play Connie Creek for a little bit and uh, quickly remember I hate that map. What? What happened bro? Why do you hate it? You said 9.9 .9 pounds for unique butterfly pickup bass. In Everglades? Yes, sir. <laughs> and let me tell you something as well, mobile. That's just the recent biggest fish, but not the biggest fish in the game. Those are just recent numbers. For example, at White Moose Lake, the biggest lake trout I've seen caught there is a 50 pound. You go there right now, you can't see 50 pounder there. It's going to be like 48, 
45. So these are just the recent numbers, not the biggest fish in the entire game. And they update these um boards really fast. So none of these numbers are the true numbers, bro. They get way bigger than that. Just that maybe someone haven't caught it as yet or they removed that digit from the leaderboard. Like I can show you some of my biggest fish and when you go to the leaderboard they remove the that big fish for something much smaller because it's a recent update for the recent uh, biggest fish they caught just not the biggest fish in the entire game <coughs> should I start with 8.8 .8 pound uh, stringer or update it just use what you have right now bro you don't need to change anything right now this is how you waste money bro you already have a net or keep net for the for the map don't change it bro that's just wasting cash over and over you just got it you need to save the cash bro next time just think before you go to a map get everything done first Gary welcome to the stream man For Everglades, yes, you will need a bigger net, bro. A hundred percent. Hey, look at this, guys. You keep one fish that you shouldn't keep and get $7,000 fine, right? For a fish that's worth a hundred dollars, man. That's why you should abide by the law. <laughs> yeah. A fish that's not even worth a thousand dollars and getting charged for a 7k for it bro releasing it sometimes release the fish and still get charged for them so crazy The weight is the same on mobile I just checked they're different uh, mobile anyone can catch a 9.9 .9 pound fish because they get bigger and bigger but they're not the same that's just one of the, like, the, the fish that can get that big but the, the boards they're totally different bro different players on PlayStation Xbox and PC but the fish they, they can get the same size, just different uh different servers, different everything, bro. They're not the same. If the fish can get that big, someone can catch the same size fish, they're just different, bro. Eels are protective species in the UK. I think Flano told me that. Was it Flano? I think so. So yes, that's something I know of right there. What's this a trophy? Well, I actually appreciate that, man. I appreciate it. 
Yep, I'll take a trophy for now. Nothing massive, but I'll take it. What's this? A mullet? If you guys haven't seen a mullet in the game, here is what they look like. We got tick clip and tell it mullets here, I think. <laughs> I'm gonna get a couple of uniques today before we leave this map. Hands down. I took my son fishing on Thursday and he uh, got his first turgeon. Damn. How big was it? Well done, guys. Well done. After I have filled my stringer 10 times, I should have enough. Once you have enough and some more after, bro. Don't always uh, leave the map because make but the exact cash you went there with or spent to get there. Always have some extras, you know. <laughs> 17 pounds, 2 ounces. Pretty decent size right there, man. For his first one. Yeah, that, that's a nice fish right there. Oh, what's this? What is this? Could be a heel, a flounder, or a mullet. It's not feeling like a mullet. It's like a, a flounder, maybe. The way it's swimming. Nope, it's a mullet. That was weird. Oh, I completed all variants of mud water this morning. I did go to Everglades, but started to fall asleep trying to get a unique sauger. I think you meant Emerald Lake, right? Not Everglades. Getting bigger, guys. Yeah, I think you might have like uh, got a typo. I got you, bro. <laughs> I got you, man. So, what were what was the hardest fish to get at Mother Water River for the challenge? <laughs> Yeah, I think I have like a number one hook for the, the flounder with duck mustard meat. But I need a new type fish right now. To show you guys, you know. Something different. The teeny tinies. The trophy fresh for the drum. Yep. Mm -hmm. There you go, bro. And they're massive too. They're big. They're not small fish, bro. Surprisingly, they show this flounder way better than the southern flounder in Blue Crab Island. That's not cast so far. Took me about two hours, uh, to even get a drum and the first one was trophy so they're they're not like uh hard to bite to get them biting it's just hard to get the big ones you know I don't know what else to say mobile. The servers and fishing planet on different platforms are different bro. 
I'm not gonna repeat myself again, bro. They're totally different. If a fish of max weight, they can reach max weight or just as the same as us, but they're different. Different players, different servers. We don't have the same players, bro. Oh, a trophy. That's a small one. What is seen is only for mobile, not for everyone. Whatever. All good, bro. You don't like uh, to take the wrong man. That's just you right there, you know. But I'm pass on with that uh, conversation right there. On to fishing. <laughs> Kept having bass and cat stealing my bait till I caught it on the spoon. In the end. Wait, you caught your drum on the spoon? No shot. Mine was on beach to be honest. Oh, come on, fish. I think I might have number four with me. I keep telling him, Richard, but he, he doesn't want to listen, bro. You know? He does want to hear, bro. We have the same fish, the same max weight. A fish can reach at any point, pound they want. We can have similar ones, but they're different. Yeah, I'm not gonna go back and forth anymore, bro. <coughs> yeah, gold casting spoon. One third, number one hook. Damn. I didn't know they had spoons, bro. If the game was if the game was cross platform, yes, we could say that okay, all fish are the same, but they're not. At least the numbers, the numbers are not the same. That's better to put it that way. I think I might go to number four for a minute to get a flounder right there. Number two. Okay, let's change this one out to like number four. Hopefully, do have it with me. Yeah, you guys, number four was it. Uh, we have a lot of hooks pretty much because we used to go around fishing for every species of fish on the map. Unfortunately, when it comes down to lower fishing here, we don't have a ton of fish that goes for lower here. The mullets bite spinners, uh, spoons, but when you go for them, they're not so active. <laughs> My bad, Andrew. That's just how it is, you know. Just that's just how it is, bro. Use the ads right there. Come on, go for it. You dropped it. 
in a minute I might move parts to some something different somewhere else, you know. No shot has scared you, man. No shot. Like you were just watching the stream and joined and then out of nowhere. The heads just popped up right there. Unexpectedly not knowing what it's gonna be. Exactly, you know. Surprise, surprise. Uh, let's move to a to a different spot for a minute. Not here, but we can fish here for the next date we go fishing. To be honest, this is a map I don't even try to master either, bro. If I don't like something, I will not put the time in it. Canny Creek was like that for me, bro. When I went there the first time, it pissed me off so much. But then I went back to it, you know, after getting into the content creation. And I just put the time in it, you know. And now, I can pretty much go there and get all the uniques in one day that fast. But this map it doesn't it's not worth it man there is no benefit of this map right here that's going to help you and that's the way i operate right there you know i go with what's the the most effective and efficient way of doing things now i might put more time in it because i got nothing to do in fish and planet but Still, I will choose a map that's still better than this one right here. Got you talking nice and calmly, then all of a sudden feels like a dream, feels like magic, and then heads are always louder than you're watching. Got to be pronounced, man. <laughs> Got to be pronounced, you know. Here we go. Lone Star has more benefits than Gent. This map is trash. Facts, bro. Like, you can pretty much go to Lone Star and have way more fun than this map right here. Number one, faster bite rate. That's that's the only thing right there would have, like, put Lone Star above this map, bro. We got something decent on what's this? Went top water for a minute. Yeah, I think the angler is one game that blocks players so fast. Like not not blocks player but as the uh a pike that deep. What? That might have the most reported uh blocked players in history for the game bro because you can block players so easily in the game you know one miss press of the button you block someone I don't know why they have that uh, option at the first place by the way wait Gary's adding out time for a steak by everyone <laughs> okay Gary take care man Having some steak for today's Sunday dinner, bro. Yes, sir. The block option should be the last option, bro. In the angler. But for some reason, it's like the first or second. New player. That's one thing with this game, bro. Every day you play this game, you have a new player. Whether they start playing the map for the first time or the game itself i don't think you can ever play this game without seeing a new player stopping by hmm. 
<laughs> yeah, make it be the last option, man. Crazy. If you can't join someone, just say, okay, uh, send a request or something like that. Don't block them because that's, that's the thing that's the option. Join, uh, view profile and then block or something like that. But if you can't join them, the block move itself to like the first option. I don't know, something like that. Yeah, I think I want to get a different peak time, bro. This one ain't saying crap right now. <laughs> okay, let's go night time for a minute. The Zunder should be fired up right now. The heel should be batting too. But let's see. I know you have a 5 a.m. to 7 a.m. peak and one in the evening. 5 p.m. to 9. That peak wasn't bad when I first came here. Just need to find it. I might do a hunter stream today, but I don't know. We'll see. We're not leaving this map today, guys, without a few uniques, or at least one. That's something that's going to happen 100%. Just going to take some time to get used to the map, you know? Again, as you guys can see, uh, we have been here gathering some of the trophies and uniques here. That was fast. What's this? No, bro, go away, man. Stop scaring my fish. You pass once in the day, you know, at night. Damn, bro. Got to work in double time, 24-7. Hey, yo, Demigod, how is the game going, bro? Is it crashing for you, or is it chilling? Mr. Perch. I heard that these fish in real life, they taste really good. Who's in chat? Who, who in chat can confirm that, you know? Do Perch really taste good? Yeah, I've heard some pretty good news for Perch and Walleyes. Crap is too. I'm a fish keeper, not a fish eater. <laughs> yeah. So you say that you never, you don't mess with, you don't mess with eating fish there. I just missed the bite right there. They taste decent, but walleye tastes better. Yeah, I heard that walleye is like top notch right there, you know? And those things get massive too in real life. The way I see a perch, I might be uh, saying this wrong or don't get me wrong guys, but the way I see a perch is like a perfect bait size fish. 
you know, or plumped. Need to. Ah, come on, man. That's a perfect bait size fish right there. For like a catfish or a pike. I will keep cod, salmon, and uh. Oh, you said that word. I don't think I'm familiar with that fish right there, Andrew. Place. Yeah, that one is new to me, bro. Not gonna lie to you. Finally, something has striked. Flounder. Perch are weird. They will eat each other if one is dead. <laughs> I mean, I, to be honest though, team, that's the fish population right there, you know. If one wants the food and you, you're the food, you're becoming the food, you know, pretty much. Trophy. Okay, getting the trophies right now. It's like a flounder. Oh. So maybe it's a fish I've never seen before then. Chicken do the same thing. Chicken will eat anything, bro. Chickens and birds, they're weird as well. They will eat anything. If it's something they can just gobble down, they'll go for it. Weird. I've seen uh, ghosts and ducks eat some of the weirdest things ever. Not gonna lie to you guys, man. Once they can gobble down what they're picking up, they're gonna eat it, bro. Because guess what? They don't taste the food, bro. You know? It just looks appealing to them. Have you guys ever seen a, a bird brain before? Or a chicken's brain? They got nothing. It's really small. So they, they don't think, you know? They just do. That's them. They just do things and make a lot of noise. That's chickens for you right there. <coughs> Place looks oh, just like found the boat with orange spots on it. Oh. I will out research that fish right there, bro. A hundred percent. So, we got some similar fish in the US and Jamaica, right? For example, we got the sun perch, but in the US they're called sun perch. We call them shiners or shads, you know. Totally same fish, but different names for them. And they get really massive too. I'm talking like 5 10 pounders. And I'm surprised they're just different, like different size here. I don't, I don't, I don't really see them as big here than the ones in Jamaica, bro. Sun perch. They eat the same things too. The sea roach. Oh, you got some sea clams as well that they eat. So the same baits too that applies for them, just different size. And the pompanos. We got pompanos in Jamaica, but we call them different. Moonshine Jacks, that's what we call them. They're silver, they got a jack-like feature to them, so they're called Moonshine Jacks in Jamaica, but different everywhere else, you know. Weird, man, just the same thing. Okay, let's take a move, bro. Damn, even the night's the same thing. It crashed, so uh, I not play the angler. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on there, my guy. 
but definitely check your heat sink to see if it's like uh, covered in dust because if the the fan ventilation isn't working bro the heat sink will be uh, overeating right there one second guys Alibot flounder place all of the same but they're technical different species yeah they, they're gonna all have something uh, to distinct them from each other like a flounder more small than alibot the place is got some spots on them you know so they're gonna have some distinctive different uh, stuff to them Look the same, but not the same, you know. Should I save up 56k to go to Everglades? That would be a reasonable cash to be uh, going to the Everglades, bro. As I said, bro, you're gonna be needing the uh, the right tools and equipments to go there. Where is the e sync at? Pretty much behind the console where you plug in the HDMI card the power supply is right behind that area so you got the you got two parts of it bro the part that the hair goes through and the part that the hair exit so the part where the ear exit is where you can see from behind the PlayStation that might look really clean, but on the part where the ear is going through, might be blocked, you know. You can't see that area unless you pull the console up. But you might can see what's happening from there as well if you, if you look carefully. I had a fish right there. And there are so many spots in this map to go to guys. But to walk and to find them. Man, just fish at the main spawn locations, man. It's like a big long stretch of a uh, canal or channel, if you guys want to say that, you know. So pretty much you got different spots in different areas. It's just out gonna get to reach towards them I don't want to go to the worm I think the spoon is just good big fish nah Dinkers, man. What's this? A flounder or a mullet? We'll take that. What's the weirdest looking aquatic animals you guys ever seen before? In any of the water bodies, river? or the ocean what's the weirdest fish ever or creature let me check something A blobfish. 
so let me see if we're thinking of the same fish a goblin shark so i, I know the goblin shark from uh stranded deep and i thought it was just a made-up story but it's actually a fish in real life and i think he got the fastest strike for the sharks out there the way they try to get their prey that shark has the fastest strike in the entire shark history or species you know pretty darn weird to be honest man they're way down deep as well just blue from the here to the east sink but that's the thing though uh demigod if the if the dust keep adding up in the playstation if that's a problem it's just gonna be piling up on each other making a thick co coat over the each sink so it's all gonna be in a cluster blowing in the the, uh, the playstation might up but only for a few days or a few hours before it goes back to what it is you know No got a barge passing by. Oh my days, everything is passing by right now, huh? For me The weirdest thing I've seen or one of the weirdest things. I would say it's a sea centipede, if you guys ever seen one before. It's like a sea worm, but different. Things are just... damn. Thinking about it right now, give me the, the goosebumps, man. If you can use a hair can, if you can reach that hair in the game or that part of the game, that'd be not bad, you know. I'm not gonna be uh, commentating for a while, I'm gonna be up to my uh, armpit in the fish tank. Gotcha, bro. Get scrubbing, Andrew. <laughs> Get scrubbing. <coughs> Damn. I know this map was that bad, but uh, I wasn't expecting this today, bro. I do hope the next day is much better, though. Not the day that, not the day that's coming up. Not that one. Definitely not. Hitting the fish. There we go. I guess we can try fish this nighttime peak for a minute. <laughs> My money is gonna be in that peak time that's coming up next and I do think those markers out there as well are like a unique uh, mullet and a tank a uh, Xander, if I'm not mistaken. Mm -hmm. Just totally different right now. Let's go to the green Norris spoon.
Oh my days, that person was level 2. What? I didn't realize that, bro. The person who left was level 2. Got to buy a DLC to come here. There's no way you should be here fishing. Level 29, 30. Okay. I don't think this fish knows that he's hooked as yet. There you go. Yeah, I think he was um sleeping while he got hooked, man. Unique car trophy. First unique. Yep. 8.9. The cash in Zunders and Walleyes are always good, man. So one unique down, I'm down to get a uh, unique flounder and a uh, mullet before we leave. Let me see something. So we need three more fish to complete this map. The bream, up. Oh, the roach, that one was giving me a problem. I catch tons of trophies, man, but never the unique. What else are we looking for? The hide, not a tough one right there. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Something is on the sale right now. Premium. Why does it say the the on sale tag there, but I don't see what's on sale right now? Wait, those baits were for hide still? I know the mini crank. I used to catch uh, the hides on um, Norris spoons, walkers as well. They bite those things and the mini crank. I know of that one, but the that roach light bait. I never used it for that before. What levels Mongolia? I think 48 or 49. I think so. But uh, I will try that bait when I can recharge to just complete this map right here. Oh, other fish right there. <coughs> okay, now now with that bait you're talking, the dragonfly. Yes, that's that's something I know of as well. You know. <clears throat> so
so many damn baits in this game bro you never really actually get a chance to fish all of them the thing is in our uh, October River I just I don't have any problem getting them there this map yes no this is not the Germany map <laughs> and Baden welcome to the stream man trophy hide lovely as we we're here talking about someone got one Oh, that spike. How long have been here for? Hour and a half almost. Not too bad. The next day, I'm rooting for the next day to give us the uniques we need to move on. Unfortunately, I don't have a match rod because I don't think match rods are going to be good on this map. It flows way too fast here. And for the flounder, way out yonder. <laughs> hey, your demigod is still here, bro. Or did you leave? Bait was pulled too far away from the fish. That's the current in the water moving the baits, man. Come on, Mr. Flounder, go for it. There you go. I don't think he's here. This could be a trophy or a unique. To be honest, I'm, I'm not even bored. Who's not here? Oh, uh, damn it, God. The, the guy that want to play with you in the angler I had a question for him <laughs> this could be the unique right there guys ain't gonna lie to y'all is it? <laughs> a trophy damn You know, I want to do a stream one day, going back to the hunter, but removing all those diamond red deers from the Great One grind to be in the, the lodge, you know. I want to just take them all down right there. I've been also thinking if I could uh, give a friend a few of the diamonds if they want to, but uh, I don't think we have anyone playing the hunter right now that wants a red deer. Mr. Trophy Perch. All plumped and ready for the frying pot, man. I would say, not... Not uh, a skinny fish, you know?
went from what three pounds to like one pound now. But yeah, Richard, that photo I sent you, man, on this card. When I saw it, I was shocked that uh, players are actually calling out other players on that platform, you know. I was shocked seeing it, you know. Crazy. Catch one unique and they all go tonight. Uh, bedtime. It's not the first time? Wait, for real? Oh. So I, I know of the, the close and go back in the, you know, the game multiple times, but I didn't know that uh, that person also plays in PC too, bro. <laughs> yeah but you can see that uh, players are actually seeing things that shouldn't be done you know and just okay let's make a claim for this right here there we go guys man money is on this peak time right here Trophy hide. Oh, come on. So we have been to the main main maps, the big ones. Now we're pretty much going to the small ones now. Well, there are a few maps I won't go to. Last Nivella for sure. I will not go to that map unless we're doing the, the, the monster fish mission there. Other than that, nothing there for me to do, man. No good reason to be there. I don't know, bro. I think this map is worse than, than, than when I left it last time. I don't know. A few trophies there and there. But, get one now, and then next 5, 10, 20 minutes, that's when you get another first hit. You start playing on PC, the competition uh, was difficult apparently. No shot. But he was accused of acting. I mean, I'm surprised he plays on PC, bro. So he got to have some tricks up his sleeve, you know. So it's like a thing they do then. So that player might just be built for that for just the competitions, you know. Because if he plays both PlayStation and PC, bro, then competition is all he does then. Pretty much. That's crazy. They just live for the competitions there. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it, man. I would have to play a few competitions then go back to like regular fishing or you know, play the game for what it is.
here we go unique doesn't look that way yo yo what's good welcome to stream I want to say your name, but I might pronounce it wrong, you know? My apologies, man. How's your day so far? Exactly, but apparently he does a uh, competition all day, every day. Personally, I have a life, and fishing pant isn't my life. <laughs> like literally every day, you see a competition. Well, back when I used to do them, I used to see him like top five all the time, bro. He just appeared of nowhere, and just took top five place, man. <clears throat> Do you have a mark for a unique bream and weeping willow to share? Do you want one? I mean, I'll take a marker. One second, guys. It's always have. It's always good to have different spots, you know. Oh, made ten time. I think I might have a few markers, but I don't think they're trophy uniques. So, uh, where do you fish? Uh, we're in Gent, Turnies, and Canal right now. Not a map that's recommended, you know. It's better to fish on Silent River map. Comparing to this map, yes. You have so much more benefits from that map, you know. Do you deserve it? Man, I'm getting troll right now. <laughs> Darn it, bro. Damn, JJ is trolling me right now, bro. Off stream, on stream is trolling. Man. <clears throat> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, here we go. What will it be? Wait, I'll be on for fishing. Uh, I'm on Central River map. What platform do you play on? PlayStation, PC, or Xbox? Or mobile, too. What's this? A flounder? No, no, not a flounder. A zander? My bad, guys. Yes, a zander. So you're you're, you're a mobile player. Got you. What's your favorite map so far? Mongolia or a different map? This might be a big one right here. 8.9. Same thing. What? So that's two uniques down right there. Two unit down, and I'm waiting for the flounder and uh, the mullet. Here we go.
Trophy. I'm wondering if that player is going for the monster mission or just getting the heals randomly, you know. We are still in the prime time of this day fashion, so we got a long day to go to get what we want. Hopefully we do get what we want. No trolls today, man. And I think what makes the fishing harder as well here is that majority of the fish don't really go for lowers here. You know, if I could catch majority of them on lower, I think I'll be cooking right now. What's this? A hide? Narrow spoon. Actually, I have mini cranks with me. Yep. I guess you can try this one for a minute. Try something different for a change, you know. Hey, Richard, question, bro. I've ever think of uh, <laughs> it's JJ's first time, bro. <laughs> it's his first time coming here to, to play this map. That shows you something, guys. A level 80 player, and it's the first time coming here. As I said, not a map. Watch this, guys. Let's see what he's going to say, bro. Oh my days, man. Let's see what he's going to say. <clears throat> As I was saying, Richard, have you ever think of uh, getting into content creating before? <clears throat> you, you have the knowledge of pretty much majority of all the games I play, man. So I think if you, if you put that knowledge into like content creating to help players, man, you got it, you know? Just wondering though. <clears throat> Let's see what uh, JJ is going to say, bro. Might be cooking something right now. When you crank, get a bite. Come on. Oh, we had a bite right there. Let's try this. So if something does bite it. Uh, it's a automatic oak set since I'm holding the oak button. I hear right behind me, bro. <laughs> I 
uh, <clears throat> I have, but unfortunately, I don't have the uh, the money to afford a decent setup to stream and do videos. My potato laptop won't be able to run all the things at once. I got you, bro. I mean, you got a Xbox too, right? Maybe you could try it from the Xbox if you want. But you said you have tried it, so I would assume that you tried on the Xbox too. Honestly, bro, it's never too late, you know? Nope, not on the Xbox. Oh, you only play with that controller, right? You don't have an Xbox. Honestly, bro, when you get a chance again, well, I would say give it another shot, you know? Welcome back, team. I'm back. My Wi-Fi was out. You got a reboot? <clears throat> I got you, bro. So, how is the, the, the fish of Falcon Lake? You getting them to bite? Another trophy. Mr. Trophy. I might have to go to like a number one out to equip the dog must meet again. Just to get a big one to hit. I don't own an Xbox, so when I get my new setup, I'll have a go again. You should, bro. But you do play a controller, right? Uh, Richard, I do think in the past, you said you played a controller too, if I'm not mistaken. I think we were talking about mouse and keyboard back in the past, and uh, I think you said driving was hard and mouse and keyboard, something like that. I could be wrong though. 3999, lovely. Okay, let's do something different, guys. You got some trophies and a can to land a unique. Uh, what oak size are you using right now? Most likely, your minnows, if you're using minnows right now, because that's going to be your best bait at your level for live bait wise. That will be your best bet to land some uniques. But if you have like a two art or a three art spinner, you'll get some nice uniques on that one too right there. I can't on keyboard and mouse because uh the way it is. Same here, bro. I don't have the the imagery or the the uh that how can I say that mentality to remember all the keys on a keyboard to be like doing stuff while not looking. I have to look on the keyboard <laughs> to actually get things done, you know. So I think that's my biggest problem is that I can't memorize the, the, the keyboard keys and the where the position where they're at, you know. GTA 5, welcome to the stream man. What's well, good? I can't play shooter games on keyboard and mouse, but I can play fishing games and hunting games. Got its weakness and got its pros, you know. Pros and cons, man. Eric, welcome to the stream, bro. What's good? A 
It's been some time, bro. I think, like, you know, the, the uh... The mouse and keyboard can be really good, but you have to be a pro at it, you know? I do think so. You have to know how to use it when playing with mouse and keyboard. But definitely a learning pattern to use it, 100%. I mean, Eight to six k a day, so not bad, bro. Depending on the fish you get in per day, you'll average around uh, five to ten k each day you sell your net or sell your fish. You know. What's this? It's a heel or mullet? It's a heel. Nice. 90% of my games are played with the controller. <laughs> yeah. I mean, to be honest though, it's much easier that way, you know? Your hands are not away from each other as far as uh, a mouse and keyboard, are like one to the left, one to the right, with a certain distance in between them. The controller. It's pretty much right there, you know? The lines are drifting too much right now. Yep. Need to recast. <coughs> I don't like the Fission Planet keyboard and mouse binds, so I play with the Xbox controller. <coughs> I think uh, a few of my uh, my friends who play uh, PC said they can't feel the vibration when they're playing the mouse and keyboard Fish and Planet when a fish strikes. So right there, that's a uh, disadvantage they have to do with as well. It's pretty much all visuals you have to work with when fishing that way. Welcome back, Demigod. What's going on, bro? So, as I said earlier, guys, it takes skills to play in mouse and keyboard, 100%. In an FPS game, I do like the mouse and keyboard, the way they can, like, uh, react fast. They can easily just turn that mouse and just look where they want to go, you know? So reaction time really fast if you're skilled with it. But uh, aiming wise it might be a little bit uh, bad depending on the, the aim assist from the controller players right there. <coughs> Fashion planet don't have a uh, vibration. Because they don't know what motors motors are there. Did I read that correctly? Or that's something else? Right. Tanks all clean. Just filling back up. Fresh and clean water, man. I can turn the vibration on and off for tanking PlayStation, if I'm not mistaken. For Fish and Planet. But that's because they uh they know it's on the control we're playing, the consoles, you know. Hold on a minute, let me see something. So you can turn it on on the PlayStation itself. You can turn it up if you want. I was trying what the vibration to be and so on. Yeah, see vibration right there on. So it's on it's on the controller as well. If 
vibrate if the line is not tensioned and that'll be annoying bro so that thing is off right there walker do i have no walkers with me i guess i can try this one for a minute If you use a third party app, you can add vibration on PC. Yeah, that's that's something I don't know about right there. But I guess if you really need to, you can have, as I said, they have things out there like that, you know. I think there are a few players in chat, Eric, that plays uh, Pushing Plant on PC. Finally. Eh. Nothing massive though. Six thirty nine. We have a few more hours to go in the peak time. I thought he dropped it for a minute right there. That was weird. He had it and then he just released it right there. <laughs> Would be nice if they made a cross platform with the new update. They won't, but we can uh, dream. Dream a little, you know? Unfortunately, the dev said no. Not in this fishing planet. There will be no cross platform, man. Maybe on Fishing Planet 2. That was his words, you know. So, uh, that could be a just three words saying, or it could be a spoiler for a different Fishing Planet in the future. Actually. Lots of poachers at this map. Man, what you talking about, bro? Who's poaching right now? <laughs> yeah, there's no way, man. There's no way you're saying this right now. Yeah, a lot we have to put into uh, the cross-platform servers, 
have any game optimized for everyone to, to play and run a smooth game together. A lot of bug fix, graphic wise, you know. A lot to be put in it right there. And to be honest, this is a old classic game from 2017. And I think it went way back to like 2015 as well, if I'm not mistaken. Yo, what's good, our uh, demigod? What's going on, bro? Two hours in this map, one unique. Lovely. I'm gonna go to the next part, and then if nothing heads, we are half this map, bro. Just got my first diamond on the angler. I post video on YouTube. What diamond was that? A bass. Yeah, I think I might stop by Naren River. <laughs> yeah. Man, JJ's going crazy. Yes, a bass, I could just tell, bro. I knew it, you know. Well done, bro, well done. <laughs> I'm still getting crashes with Call of the Wild, the angler. I tried three fixes, no luck. Honestly, Eric, the game been a mess, bro. It's been a mess, bro. Honestly. A big mess lately, and all fix they did as well, not working. So, I don't know what's going on, bro. You play the game, you have fun for, for a hour, and then the game crashed. No reason. Last part right here, guys, I thought, you know. I thought we could uh, get the uniques we need here, but we only got one type of fish, the Xander, you know. Miss Cassie, I can't see anything right there. Hold one second, guys. I think I messed up, I got fishing plant on epic game launcher. I mean you play on uh, what do you play on team, Xbox or PC? I don't think you mess up bro, I think you're okay man. The only problem with that is if they want to upgrade uh, the graphics and had cross play they have to redo the the coding changing to different engines which means we'll have to pay for the game all that work put in it won't be free definitely not you know so I can see that happening bro pretty much any new game right now won't be free it's gonna be like a uh, pay to play right there Tons of trophies today, but not many uniques. So for Eric, the crash are like back to back for him then.
I always got two hats uh, when they pop up. Timo and TikTok give me some uh, diversity, damn it. <laughs> yeah, that one has been haunting you, bro. Ain't gonna lie to you, man. You can pretty much say Andrew that that you own the heads right there, you know. Your special one right there. Oh, uh, let me do something, guys. Oh, four minutes. Yeah, we're going down the peak right now. Yeah, I'm gonna go to a different map. I can actually get fish to buy it, bro. This map, you will never see me come back here, guys. Unless it's someone that requests to like get a fish or something, you know, I want to see it, but stream wise, never. Of my own will, you know. I think I need a few match rods too for the new for the next map we're going to. Get some big croppies, man. Mr. Hyde. <coughs> For me, it's, it's pretty much all the maps for me that crashes, man. Well, I think so far, the ones that got the crash mostly is uh, Golden Ridge and um, South Africa. I have not been to Spain as much. Norway, it lags out, but it doesn't kick you. Yeah, guys, it's gonna be moving in a minute, bro. You gonna take it? I would like to go to Narin River today, but it's gonna be a slow one. That's for sure. So I just want to get some fast bat rates right now, bro. Some fast ones, you know. What's this? Flounder? Finally, bro. Damn. Well, we got uniques now, guys. We got two now. Unfortunately, Mr. Ticklip Mullet don't want to bite. So, I will take those two uniques right there. The Zander and the Flounder. And uh, I'm cooking right there. I'm good to go.
One second, guys. Yeah, we're hot here, bro. Sayonara, Jan Turn you Zan. Over, you say your name. Not cooking here anymore, bro. We made no cash here, bro. None. <laughs> okay. We can remove that. At least have one matra with us. Matra telescopic rod, I don't mind. <laughs> 3k for one day man alright tell me about it bro yeah I mean pretty much all the players were pretty much get getting there were trophies too man telescopic rod The most broken equipment in the game right here used to be until it's uh, retired. Where is that? Rod relay, bro. Where is it? Backpack is full, of course. I guess you can use this. I'm gonna get some crappies. Uh, I don't mind risking this rod with a a platted catfish. She can do it, do the job. I just don't want a guard to bite. I'm done. <clears throat> yeah, I wish I could get uh, get some uh, give some advice on PC, but uh, I got no knowledge in that area, you know. So there you go, guys. That's the heal bait right there for the uh, the cannibal healing giant. But uh, as I said, I would have to delete this for all the mission so you guys can see the mission step by step. But if I really wanted to get the, the monster, I could have got him, you know. Where the base up, bro? Leeches, did I pass them? They, they were in my backpack, lovely. Get some minnows. And this one for the catfish. <coughs> I'm gonna go with frogs for now. And I'll be doing bottom fishing for some uh, smallmouth bass, by the way. Half ounce. Worm. Let's see what players are here getting today to bite. Why can't I travel? There we go. 
hopefully Eric can get that game to play, man. But as I said, we have, we have all been uh, experiencing problems with that uh, game lately, you know. And all platforms too. Let everything load in, load in before we move, guys. After. Why can't I see the players that are in the lobby right now, bro? Them controls are stupid sometimes. <clears throat> okay, peak time. Question, guys. Are the, the controls on a uh, mouse and keyboard fishing pants better? Because here we have to press so many buttons to go different directions, you know. It's crazy, man. It's one of the hardest uh, things to do in the game is to navigate yourself around it. Is it good if I break my rod? All up to you, man. You made the choice right there. You already know the answer to that question, bro. I don't have to say what's right from what, what's wrong. I guess you can get some catfish here. <laughs> okay, I see uh, Keen online right now. Get into the grind. Oh. Naren River got nothing on the Falcon Lake, bro. Nothing. I'm back. Tanks all clean and full fish are fed in happy days. All they need, Andrew, is a song, you know? And you're good to go, bro. Okay, so while we're doing that. Let's get some bass to bite. Oh, come on. Was it a big jig winner? Or, uh, you know, a small one? Pumpkin seed. I have broken a couple of my jig winners before, put a massive crankbait on it, ignore the fact that they warned me that it's too heavy, cast out there, snapped. <laughs> Snap that bro, like a twig. Me sing to the fish, how oh, hell no. But type, if you want a song, bro, look for Lion Oak and Sinker. The perfect song for the fish right there, you know. My rod is 36%. So pretty much you have to go repair that rod, man. And keep in mind when your rod decreases uh, more, the more cash will pay for it. It goes for every gear. <clears throat> yeah, my game is kind of bugging out, but uh, that's public lobby for you right there. If this doesn't work, we go to the bass jig.
Speaking of breaking rods, I need to do a challenge to break three rods, reel in line. I mean, you can get like a, a cheap rod, snap them together, you know, but uh, up to you guys. <coughs> Here we go. Oh, we have fish on there on this one too. Crap. This is not crappy, bro. What's this? It is a crappy. We'll take it. What? What? What did it just say to me? What happened there? Did it break my equipment or just release it? It snapped it, bro. What? Yo. But what? <laughs> By what fish though? We got pickles there, but they shouldn't be able to break this one, bro. Darn the fishing planet, bro. It might have been chafed off, you know. Hello? Oh, uh, you're on fishing planet. Nice. Yes, sir. Welcome to the stream, man. How's it going? That has to be like a, a pickerel or something, bro. Nice, man. Nice. It's a good thing I'm not using anything expensive, you know, like an X-Series lure. There we go again. No, you don't need titanium for this map, bro. That was a, a troll right there, bro. Because I leave the line on... Uh, what can I say now? Unattended? Yeah, it, it snaps like that. Not the first time, though. I have caught carps before that goes in the weeds and snap me half as well. I don't think these uh, pickers get past trophy, if I'm not mistaken. We're gonna make it happen, guys. We got one fish down. One broken equipment. Lovely. Good start. <coughs> Getting snags right now. Venting three cars. Wait, where is the thing? Use it? What? Stop it, bro. I thought I had it in water, it wasn't there. One second. There we go. I think I'm taking one of these rods here. Not this one. <coughs> yeah, I don't think it was a fish, bro. It says it said that it was a fish, but it wasn't. If you left your line just fighting the fish, it will just snap and say the fish breaks it.
I still think the Draco boat sucks. It drives like a tank. On maps, it shouldn't be, yes. Broke up island. That map uh, is not made for that boat, bro. I think we messed up. No bass jigs, bro. Nice. No bass jigs, bro. I'll have to leave to get some bass jigs with me. I guess we'll just use the worm for now then. The year broke. Not like you though. I might be broke, but you're a broker, you know. <laughs> if that's the word right there. <laughs> yeah. Hey man. <clears throat> So another bait we're missing today again. The bass jigs, bro. Catfish, yep. <coughs> And then God, you know, you don't know what you're talking about, bro. You're in denial right now, the way you're broke, you know. There we go. Look, this thing works nothing here. Watch this. 85 XP for a 18 pound fish, guys. You see that? Not worth it. Marius, welcome to the stream. Where are you fishing? Narin River. Gizzard Shad. American Shad. Here? I thought they were further up the river. Wow. So right there, what we basically use those fish for is the uh, place older. If we want that to be filled in time, or full in time, we uh, pretty much use that right there. Hey Chad, give me a few minutes man, give me a few minutes.
Okay, I'm back. My my bad, guys. OMG, give me a different hat. Yeah, I just got a uh, auto sport hat as well, Andrew. Do we have any tips for catching unique hybrid F1 carp? <laughs> That's a hard fish right there, bro. Uh, tip, sunny day. Sunny day, blood worm, number one. Number one hook. Give it a try, man. Hard fish right there. But honestly, overall, that fish is a hard fish to get, bro. <clears throat> uh oh. Catfish gotta wait for a minute. What's this? A pumpkin seed, bro? Or a sunfish? Sunfish, right? Yep. Oh, I made it to level 80 last week. I haven't uh, bought anything from the shop for level 80. I mean, uh, you can save that cash right there for the oceanic map, you know? But you got the, what, how many you said? 7 mil? That's pretty nice right there. I caught a unique hybrid F1 and then about 5 minutes after, or later, had the mission to catch this unique or catch all the uniques took forever to get another one mind boggling bro drive you crazy right there so you catch the up oh, don't you dare get out fish the unique right here can be a pain but if you go to the right spot with blood they go crazy for it man I'm surprised a fish go for blood, you know. That's like not even like a catfish. It's just a, a panfish. Hey chat, just an heads up, it's about to get noisy, so I might have to mute my microphone now and then, you know. Richard, welcome back from the 420 break, man. I spent nearly one mil earlier, bought four new float rods and a reel. We're talking uh, spell launchers for the float rods to be that expensive. Have to be a high ranked match, uh, match rods, you know. One second, guys. So you buy the equator match, the ones for the Congo right there. Yeah, those will cost you a few cash right there, man. Rise on real, yeah. So got a few trophies down so far, guys. I'm I will be getting some uniques here. I will have to leave though to get my bass jigs with me. We need them here. Pull up your cute net, see how much money you made so far. That's for me, Eric, or uh, someone in chat. We lost the fish? Wasn't paying attention, bro. I look I look in chat. Fish is off. Nice. Me? Uh okay, give me a minute guys. 
judging on what I have so far might have been uh, let's say almost 2000 maybe let's see I'm gonna say 1500 to 2 2k I don't know man I don't think I reached 2k to be honest let me see what we have so far 1500 crappy or bass which one is it what is this oh my days bro That part right there, team, I will not give advice on spending real money in the game. I can't help you in that one, bro. But what I can say if you're buying a pack, make sure that you have a good enough rod slash rods, keep that, and a good map to go to farm. But I will not help you on buying DLC. Not something I do right here, bro. You're rushing the game, bro. You're rushing way too fast. That's for sure, you're rushing way too fast, bro. <laughs> What's this? Small mo bass or larger? Don't break me off now. We should be good. <clears throat> what do you mean by that, Demi God? What are you trying to say, man? So one day so far here, and I made way more cash in one day already. Then they're in river. No, oh, not there in river. Gen turn you zen. Easy, easy. There we go. Two pounder, bro. Yeah, I pretty much went through this with team yesterday, man. Showed him everything he wants to see that uh, he's not ready for Everglades. A map that's bigger than him, you know, so. I tried, bro. If you make a mistake, don't take the advice. That's all on you, bro. Cancel we didn't try, you know. Right, 
right now he's just rushing the game and that's going to cause a lot of mistakes right there but uh, hopefully when you do make those mistakes you learn from them and it's not too late either So if you guys recall the player yesterday in stream, I don't think Andrew was here yesterday. Keen one, he's grinding right now. And he's pretty much going great right now, bro. He's at level 25 and he saw the potential in Falcon Lake and now he's just locked in. He's like, yep, I'm gonna be here for a while getting these fish, you know. It's not in any order to move on from there. And he was like pretty new to the game again. You know, he played a while back. And he's back again, you know. And so far, he's doing pretty good. The more you rush this game, the more mistake you you'll make, the more money you spend. Not only money in the game, but real life cash. There we go. Trophy maybe? Can't say. Why do you keep going over that rock right there, bro? That trophy, not bad. I think I'll have to leave to get the bass jig. How long have been streaming for today? And Tima, I'm hoping you read in the comments that they're helping you with in chat, but you know, it's really important to uh, To see what they're all saying, you know. Yeah, I caught a few under the spinner bait. Just I don't really like them as much, you know. Yummy, welcome to <laughs> welcome to the stream, man. You know, a minute ago my mind just ran on you, bro. I was like, I haven't seen you all day, bro. What's well, good? Let me see if I have any spinning baits with me right now. Yeah, I think uh, I I even have a marker out there to throw it a uh. Spinner bait fishing wet. 
Mm, I don't think I have any with me, bro. For some reason, I uh, took them out my backpack. Nice. Really nice. What was I doing when I took them out my backpack? Another sunfish. <clears throat> yeah, I used to have a ton of lures in my backpack. Bass jigs, printers. I think some event I was doing, bro that required space and I just took all of them out to the moment because I never really unpacked my backpack before you know that's something I don't do Pro Angler DLC 50% off Microsoft and PS4 for a fishing plan never have discount for here of premium oh they have a couple of discounts a while back even recently they had the congo dlc off i think 25 percent and then a few weeks after that they had another congo sale down maybe you're just missing them bro okay harry take care man I retired from the hangler, get back into fishing planet. No way. It's like now nah, we're not having the crashes today, man. We're heading back into fishing planet, bro. Farno, welcome to the stream, bro. Roy Hat, Narin River. We're in Narren River at the moment. What have you been up to, bro? And that seems pretty distant. What will it be down? Crappy? I don't think a crappy should be fighting this rod. Oh, come on. I think it might be a catfish or something, bro. A crappy shouldn't be fighting like this. Let me see. Yes, yeah, a damn catfish, bro. Mm hmm Worth nothing. <laughs> if you ain't getting the trophies and uniques, those flathead caps are not worth anything, bro. Do you need some markers for this map? In a minute, bro, I got you. See if you can catch the uh booty. Damn thing been uh doing my head hen. So I have already got the boot mission done as well. I need a tank. Uh, let's see something, bro. Hunter, welcome to the stream, man. Musk is at Michigan. St. Croix. Collecting. 
So all I need is the the, uh, the backlash. Not the backlash with weed. That's different. You know. That's all I need for this mission to complete it. The hard one to get is the rag. The boot is not so hard, man. At Blue Crab Island, you can get the boot pretty easy. All I need is a boot. Damn. I would I would recommend going to uh Blue Crab Island, bro. I'm sending some markers. That's the white copy, right? Was it? Yeah. Got the black copy here too. The markers are stacked up on each other. Like a cone fish. There are more markers here, I just can't pinpoint them. Darn it, bro. Give him the unique guard here. One second, guys. <coughs> I'll go to Yami. What's uh, what's the level right now? I want to see if I can get him like a unique of every fish so far. Uh, I guess we can send this spot as well. Hmm. The bass will be here. Yeah, we're gonna need them all uh, bass jigs today, bro. Them snakehead. That's for the uh the mission for I think what was it? What event was that? Level 13 right now, I don't have time to stay up late, but I'm finna grind right now. A few hours might not be so bad, bro. So you're pretty much at Emerald Lake then. Yeah. Okay, so you had to Emerald Lake. You did a bit of grinding. Nice. How did it go for you? Did I miss any comment in chat? Where have Blue Crab Island? Okay, so my spot where I got the boat was pretty much the main uh, mangrove area out by the barge near that area, the main spot for the tarpons. That small island where you can stand on and fish. That's where I got mines, bro. And who knows, you could catch anything else there, you know? But that's where I got all my items, pretty much. Yo, this man really came to Narin River. Wait, the Mackenzie bottom runs, bro. 86 pounders. Oh, I, I don't think they're 86 pounds right now. He doesn't have the max ones. This guy is crazy right now, bro. Okay, I went... To call out the wild uh, the angler settings the resolution isn't highlighter or highlighted so you're saying that they're not there for you nice fish bro nice one right there pull up got his crappy <laughs> so they're they can't be adjusted then. Yeah, that that that's Mr. Demigod from the chat, man. <laughs> yeah. 
this man hating to messing with these fish right now, bro. Man, he's like, yo, we're going harder to go home right now, bro. 80 pound a rod for like a 4 pound fish. Crazy. Nice one, trophy. Yeah, you're trolling, bro. Any tips for both sharks? Match rods, partly sunny day, 7 to 9 p.m. Using our uh, blood, 10 odd hook, 15 to 30 inches for the depth. My bad guys, I want to catch at least a hundred pounds of fish before we leave and get the lures we're looking for. Now what is shaking the head up bro? Oh wrong rod. Hey Hunter, what platform do you play on? Xbox, PlayStation, or PC? <coughs> What's this? My unique? Ah, look out that, bro. Not a unique or a shad. Is the money good on that map? It's okay. Not the best, but it's okay, bro. <coughs> oh, come on. There you go. It's pretty decent than Mudwater River, Blaston Villa, and Gen Turnizen. 100%. But this map got nothing on Emerald Lake or Falcon Lake, bro. Nothing. Take my word for it. Driving a vehicle in Call of the Wild Angler is impossible. What happened? Walleye well, gives me 300 cash. I think the fish on this map that would give you that much cash would be the bass. The crappies are pretty good too, man, because here, a three pound crappie would be a unique. Oh, we got some company. And the good thing is, well, you can get crappies with lures, like a, a, a grub or something, or the fish right there. <laughs> so many rods in the water right now, bro. Yeah, I'm not even going to pay me any attention, bro. I'm just going to get my fish in. <coughs> what fish are you most excited for in a new map? The Mai Mai is. Only because those fish can bite topwater lowers. I'm a big fan of topwater fishing. Then we got, don't do that, bro. You got player fishing work right there, bro. Don't it in front of him. <coughs> mm. 
Now he's going to do the same thing back to you. Where did he go? <clears throat> you lucky didn't stand in front of you, bro. So one more fish and we should be uh, going back home for some baits, man. So pretty much, yummy. You will have to just get those uh, those walleyes. The saugers are pretty good, but uh, you have to cross over to get the wall. There's a the saugers, man. In hard to do that, you will need a boat or a kayak. You know, you got some nice, unique uh, pickers there. But they had daytime. Catfish, bro. No. Okay, guys, let's go back home. Get some baits for the bigger uniques out there. One day, three thousand dollars. I mean, four. My bad. What did what did I make in gent? Less than that in like what? Two, three days. Not worth it, man. Okay, uh, let's go home. Get this one as well. What do you mean backpack is full, bro? Damn game, bro. Come on. Get rid of that one right there. Any duplicates, I'm removing them. <clears throat> we should be good to go. Spinner baits at we can go with that one. Yeah, I think I'll go with that one right there. No, I won't be coming back to Naran River, Mr. Y Gene, because the big head is in the way, bro. You got a big head and a thick skull, so I can't see through your head, bro. It's too big. <laughs> Yo, wait, what? There you go. <clears throat> Let's do this. Get back with, with the worm. I'm just messing with you, bro. I'm coming back there, you know. There we go. <clears throat> As much time as much as this game teaches you uh, to spend money wisely, where else can you drop thirty thousand on vegetables? Mm. So wait, you're saying that you spend thirty k on vegetables in this game? Oh, it's packed. Is it? Yep, room is full. Yeah, just spend 30k on vegetables and 30k on technoplanktons. I mean, damn, bro. You didn't have to buy so many, though, bro. Where are you heading to? What map? 
Uh, I don't want to fish that peak down, bro. I got 500 of each. Normally I buy like 100 to 200 baits, you know. Me and Dell grind in the bag to see for some carps. Make sure that you guys have the match rods for the bigger than silvers. And that the bottom rods are carp rods for the the common carp, mirror leather, grass carp. <coughs> I'm surprised that someone took my spot that fast in the lobby earlier, bro. Instantly take it, bro. One second. We should be good now. We're not leaving here without getting a couple more uniques to be honest man. How long did it take you to catch that unique hybrid F1 carp? Honestly? It took me a few days, both in real life and in the game. But once I found the spot for it, bro, I got more than one unique there before, you know. I do have a few videos for it as well. If you if you want to go check check it out, you can uh, do that. You might see something that you haven't seen before, or. Something similar to what you've been doing. Oh, uh, crap. I guess you can... Yeah, the hybrid F1 and the, uh, the Vulgar Zander. Two of the artists fishing the game to catch. I'll do I do the monster buffalo uh, mission so pretty much yummy you have to catch backlash with weeds and keep them once you keep them but well, where they are hat they're in the lily pads right the lily pads are going to be getting them there once you keep them it's going to give you like a invisible line right then you will have to use a match rod or a telescopic rod to catch the buffalo or uh, monster fish. I do have a video for it as well, Yami, if you want to see where I got my uh, lines at. Crappy? Yes, sir. Oh, a new PR, baby. New PR. Mm hmm. Catfish, bro. I don't mind a good fight. Thank you, Andrew. Wait, we got. Oh, I thought we had three players here. All good yummy. Just the only reason why I recommend the video because you might wanna know what spot I got the fish and the line, you know. Welcome back team. Team three I am Hey Why did you why did you pick three AM though bro? Is there any specific reason? Mr. Uh, 
Wait, you changed your name, bro? It's not Wolf God anymore. It's Egyptian Wolf. Welcome to the stream, bro. I need to match the telescopic rod here. Man is sleeping right now. I have a fish on, but not getting the fish in. No way. Okay, guys. Let's see how long it takes me to get my uh, unique small mud bass. I don't know. My friend told me to to put it because his name is 3 a.m. <laughs> hey, man. All good, bro. Just, just wondering, you know. Just wondering. What fish? What fish does he have right now? I hear something. Looks just like you, dummy god. The perfect fish to catch, man. <coughs> And I decide not to get a pack. I just wait. At this level, you don't need one, bro. But as I said, if you get in a pack, make sure you get a nice rod slash rods, a really good map to fish. You know, and premium would be nice. So don't spend your money in like, you know, for rods or anything. Make sure you have a map to grind, bro. With decent fish to get XP and cash uh, for, you know, or from. Change the current YouTube name, even though I'm still not into my uh, main account. All good, man. <coughs> Struggling with money sucks. What's going on? Man, showing off his dinker catfish, bro. Trophy? Watch this crap, bro. Taste the fish, man. This is this is kids these days, you know? <laughs> I, I'm not like that, guys. I just, you know, sometimes I like to pay back someone for what they do, you know? I'm a very revengeful person. That's me right there. But not the the person who's gonna be salty, you know. When I get iron, I might just get a uh, sport pack rod. As long as you have a map. To use those rods on bro keep in mind your equipment will be uh given the xp this depending on, on what fish you get and how big they are on those rods Angler is bugging out. Yep. Been broken since the uh the new map update, you know. When is it not bugging out? Good question.
Okay, then we got enough of that, bro. We're streaming right now, bro. I let you have fun. Now it's time to uh, get serious. <laughs> Yeah, just make sure that you... Oh, there's a head on the stream right now. As I was saying, team, make sure you have the right maps to use those rods if you do something like that, you know. So we got the white crappy, right? We need the black crappy too as well. They're both in the same spot. One is just, you know, a little bit more difficult to get. What? Where's the winner? Right here, man. <clears throat> Besides the three the three crashes on Friday, it's been smooth for me this weekend. Only uh thing is the time warping. <laughs> So when it's not one thing, it's the other, you know? Time warping or your players getting kicked. Because I would use uh, them as St. Croix and the other maps. St. Croix with 20 pound rod would be pretty good, man. 20, 30 pound rod would be, would be, would be nice. But look at it this way as well, team. Depending on what level you are, you will have all those pound of rods in the shop available, you know, depending on your level. <coughs> Trophy. Okay, we'll take that. Oh my days of a lot of noise right now. Thank you. 
Okay, I should be back, guys. You know, while I was here for that moment, I was muted. I think I'm down to do a uh, Everglades stream one day. Go to get some uniques, you know. Go top water fishing for a minute. I mean, what time is it today? 12 minutes to 4. Yeah, I think Everglades might be a different stream. You know, we kind of everything today, man. I don't think so. If we do all the maps today, we don't have any other maps to go to next time. But I'm down to go Everglades one day. Where hard the black crap is that man? Why do why do not bite on? Do I need to go to a grub to get this fish to bite? <coughs> Yo, Aiden, it's been a while, bro. Welcome to the stream, man. What have been up to? I seem to not get my uh, smallmouth bass biting right now. Not the big ones, at least. <coughs> Man, it's, it is in real life uh, fishing time. So you're out fishing then. Was it in striped bass? Or a different fish? There we go. Oh, it's striped bass season? No way. Oh, come on. Why'd they go over the rock like that, bro? I have been uh, fishing in the Delaware River. I live four minutes away from it. That's pretty close, man. So you can pretty much go fishing whenever you want then. That has to be good, bro. Look at this crap. What? Why do they go up the rock like that, bro? I don't think the fish is going up the rock. It's that they're swimming behind it. There's a small, uh, what do you call it? Like a cove around there. Let me show you guys. This cove right here. When I get the fish here, it swims around here and then goes over the rock, the line. That's what looks that way. Weird, man. But uh, Aiden, good to hear from you, man. Good to hear that you're doing good. You've just been busy fishing, you know. Got to get those fish while the season is open. Once it's closed, you can't keep them. I have been, you know, doing pretty okay so far, bro. Still grinding. Say what? Okay, fish on planet. Y'all better fix these bugs before that uh, software map comes out, man. I don't want to be losing my tunes that way. 
imagine catching a big tuna, come stop water, spit the bait. I'll be pissed off, man. Not really pissed off. But then again, it's a real life feature right there. Not because a fish uh, has the bait in his mouth, mean that he will not spit the bait if he wants to. It's not, uh, how can I say, guaranteed. He's properly hooked, you know. So I might think it's a bug, but it could be that feature they added, you know. My bad. Oh, we had the fish right there. Honestly, we're all waiting for a new map, bro. We just got a update with all the fish, lower as they want to go with, depth, stuff like that, you know. So all of the fish been revealed, how big they get, stuff like that, you know. Just no release date right now. <clears throat> D, is there anything I can do to get bigger uh, big head and silver carp? Both my big heads are 67. You pretty much gonna need a uh, oversized carp mix to get the 100 pounders, man. The oversized carp mix will get you those big guys, bro. And you will be needing to use the 10 odd hooks. Or even bigger if you want to go bigger, you know. I still watch you a lot, but I don't text and chat all the time. I got you, bro. I appreciate that still, you know. That's on the spot rod. So it's in the, the spot uh, thingy. But yeah, you have to mix the, the cart mix to put in the... The spot to use the spot rod with it, you know. So you can you can make a mix yourself, or you can uh, try some mix out there, man. I have a pretty decent one if you want to try it. Uh, catfish, bro. Come on. Yeah, I'll play Fortnite now and then. Hey, then. Took a break from Call of Duty. Went over to Fortnite. Not so bad, you know? Not so bad, bro. <laughs> and the mix, the mix, uh, Andrew doesn't only work for the bigger carps. It works for the all the carps there is in the game, bro. Except maybe like the F1 hybrid carp. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I haven't tried to that fish yet because when I try it there, pretty much the other carps go for it instead. So pretty much all the fish that gets oversized, it works for them. Ha 
Has to be a crappie, bro. Come on. Wait, hey, team, you live in New Jersey, bro? Oh, come on. Let me use my lore for a minute, bro. I mean, I'm getting fish, though, you know, so I'm good. Don't you have a, not gizzard shot, but a, uh, a American shot competition on this map? I don't think so. This spot ain't bad, man, for them shots right there. I live in Orlando. Okay, it's so not New Jersey then. <laughs> My bad, bro. I see you asking chat, so I thought you were familiar with this place, you know? So you have family in New Jersey that lived here for about 25 years? No shot. I mean, that's where I'm at right now. You know, so me and Aiden is pretty much close by uh, in the area, just, uh, you know, yeah. <coughs> we got a hundred pounds of fish already. Including some catfish. Here comes another shad, is it? Could be a sunfish or a crappie. Dinker, bro. Damn. The black crappie is biting now. Nice. Not nice. That's the wrong one right there. I would go get some uh, gars. And I might go for them. But I will have to change my leader to titanium. I might try to spinner bait in a minute too. Yeah, we're losing this fish. We're losing it. Can I get it in time? Come on, bro. What's going on here? We got it, we got it. Hey, Andrew, you still here, bro? I need to give you some uh, information before you use the mix as well. 
just so you try it and don't uh, use the wrong measurements for the the recipe, you know. So let me show you something, bro. Okay, so I have the recipe already locked in, right? But let me just redo it for you, bro. To show you something, because a lot of players get this thing wrong. And if you don't have the right numbers for it, you will make the wrong mistake. And it might resu result in less fish, you know. By the way, what are you playing? You playing uh what metrics do you play in bro? <clears throat> because it might be uh different for you to playing like uh KG or grams you know Weeping Willow getting some carbs right there same as you I'm screen recording all right so you're good then big riverine you need 12 ounces of this one right here all right actually <laughs> 22 22 my bad 22 bro yes 22 bro that's a 12 that's a catfish destroyer carp rival you need all of it so max right this is not the tricky part yet we're gonna get there in a minute for the catfish destroyer 12 and had the aromas first before the particles right sweet crotion two ounce each for all aromas only two ounces if you had too much you might it might be too much for the fish and they might just reject the the mix you know to the few fruity uh two ounces x flavor supreme same two right now watch this bro the particles there should be eight ounces but watch what's gonna happen all of it that one is added watch this now bro it's supposed to say eight ounces but it says seven so all you got to do is had it right and we had the same particle that he had before increase it it goes it goes to eight ounces so when you have had it all of these and it says seven just re had the same one and it will go to eight you should be good there so if you notice I did not go back to a new one I stick with the old one I had it first so be careful when you add in the, the particle last you know yes sir this mix was mainly made for weeping willow oversized carp but I tried it at Sunday Burger Sea got a massive big head uh, and silver carp there really good for it bro And uh, just an edges up. Oh, the edges is on this stream. Nice. One second, man. Okay, we should be good. All good, man. All good. Now, this was taught to me by Richard yesterday. So when you use the oversized mix, right? You get your oversized fish 98 to 100 for both of the uh well over 100 for both big ed carps and silver carps you can switch back to a four odds hook or six to get smaller uniques and trophies 
So when you get your oversized carps, do not think the mix is finished. You just won't get a massive carp anymore. You will get the regular ones down. Like the 60 pounder uniques, the 30 pounder trophies, you know. <clears throat> all good bro hope oh, all the mix does work for you in pc bro well you play in pc or xbox it's one of them right fortnite god welcome to the stream man a lot of senior Fortnite videos. You look good at the game. <laughs> I'm trying, man. I do play Fortnite, though, you know. I'm okay at it, but I'm not so good yet, you know. Still learning. I've got two catfish on right now. So hey, Fortnite guy, what modes do you play, man? Zero build or no, uh, or the regular one? And hey, Andrew, don't be afraid to make your own mix or to try out anyone's mix out there. They all got different ingredients, you know, different type fish you get as well. So you'd be surprised, man. So you play both of them, builds and no builds. Nice. I tried uh, builds once before, but I'm not so good on building, man. I can't do it, you know. Because I have to be focused on taking on opponents at the same time building, you know. As I said, still learning. <laughs> what do you play on? I did try making mixes when I was uh, level 51, but couldn't get my head around it. Same here, bro. I think what got me all confused were the numbers. The numbers are really important to know what you're putting in the mix, bro. As I said, you can go over the board and instead of attracting the fish, you're putting them you're pushing them away from the bait or the mix, you know. Oh you have a Nintendo Switch? Cool. I think once uh you know once I get into uh, Fortnite more I might consider streaming it, but for now the content is like not on stream, you know. Yeah, I play all kind of game team gta 5 god of war red Dead redemption fish and plant the hangler <coughs> days gone far cry those are new games right there though for me to stream last of us i play battlefield 2024 i think or 2020 one of them stranded deep the forest yeah 
I need to get back into seven days to die. I just haven't got the basics done yet, man. I need to get back into it, bro. So I'm pretty much an all-arounder streamer, bro. I play all types of game, except maybe car games, you know. Yeah, I'm not so good with the car driving stuff right there. All right, let's change my spot for a minute. So I haven't played Red Dead 1 before. I haven't played that one. Red Dead 2 is where I started from, you know. And I'm a big online player. Most players of Red Dead likes the story. It's a really good story, but I'm more like an online player, you know. And walkers, bro? Mm. I guess I can try this for a minute. What does the third money do? I have zero. Oh, that's your club token. If you're in a club with friends and, you know, family if you want. Once you compete, you win the leagues like uh, Rookie League, Pro expert and so on once you compete in windows leagues you get tokens after competing and qualifying right there so that's not in the game anymore at the moment it's going to be in the game when the new map is here of course you can also uh, get these club tokens in a different way but honestly, I won't say how because uh, honestly, bro, it's not worth going out your way to get them. So I'm trying for some pickles right now, guys. Is this a gar? Oh my, I gotta be careful then. I got to be careful, bro. I don't want to lose my patriotic walker. It's really good. If this is a second guard, I will have to change this to titanium, to be honest, man. I thought it was something like the Hangler. Nah. The only thing we have, like the Hangler, or the Hangler offers us, is the big coins. The ghoul coins, they're pretty similar. It is a car, bro. <laughs> Trophy. <coughs> Trophy. So I have caught cars and poppers and walkers and look up island, but never here. Not bad, bro. XP way more than the catfish so these fish are way better to catch than the catfish of course it's a trophy sized fish but at the same time a 21 pound catfish giving like 95 xp not worth it this one way better man uh, do i have any leaders with me <coughs> Oh, 
I guess it can go with 18 pound liter. The fish stop biting. Is it uh, not peak time anymore? Keep in mind, bro, you can always go to a different spot. They got so many spots at Falcon Light, bro. So many spots there. Yo, Demi got it in chat, bro. The middle peak. From like 1 p.m. to... Oh, there's a fish right there. So I would say just find a different spot, man. Or try different baits, you know. Red fin pickerels, one of the best looking fish right here. I like the fins, bro. And I'm a sucker for red color, so that's just me. When last did the game shut down on you, bro? Is it working now? So you're perfect then. How is the temperature? Is it uh, same same temperature or different? No, oh, I talked about it right there. It's warm. And that much is expected right there too, you know. So you got warm and you got hot. It's like really hot, man. You're pretty much running a uh, a system. You know, each sink, the energy is going in it. It's going to get warm at times, you know. So that's natural. But when the temperature is too much, you know that something is wrong. So I can't say what's causing the problem yet, bro. But definitely, try to get the, the console cleaned, right? And see if that fix it when you get a chance to. I put on titanium, they're not hitting anymore. Fish are smart, man, they're seeing the titanium, you know. The floral, not so much, you're not really seeing it. I don't know when I play the angler, my game gets hot, but it never turns off on me unless the game, like, you know, crashes, bro. I'm going to Everglades when my rod is at 2%. You made the choice, man. We give you all the help we can. So you got to make the right choice, bro. Missing the bites right now. That was a nice bass. I still don't get why you're making the rod deplete its duration, durability. So right there, instead of saving yourself cash, you're making yourself spend more by repairing that rod, bro. So either way you take it, if you don't repair it, you'll have to get another one. And that's still money. So you're making things harder for yourself, man. You should be saving it, but you're saving it to spend it. 
on multiple things that you should not be uh, doing right now. Come on, hit it. There you go. Pay crow. Give me a trophy. They do get to trophies here, right? Yes, they do. <coughs> Let's see if they want a smaller puffer. Where is that? The slower I'm going to works pretty good in the Everglades. For the uh the pickup bass man, they go crazy for it. And so does the gar. Be careful of those fish there. I don't mind not using titanium with this one. Because this one I can buy in the shop whenever. Event lowers, bait coin lowers, you lose those things man. You're in a bad spot. Removing the titanium for a minute, guys. <coughs> that should be just good enough. I'm free to grind emeralds now. Sounds good, man. Sounds really good. And uh, yeah, I mean, if you're curious of daytime fishing, bro, don't be afraid to, to test it, you know. If you want to test a different spot, there's a big gun right there, big one. Don't be afraid to try daytime if you want. All you need is one big coin to skip if that daytime doesn't get you what you want, you know. Then you can go back to nighttime if you want to fish there. It's not a lot of fish right now. Hit it. There you go. Trophy? It's a pickerel. You can tell by the splash. Nope, not quite a trophy, man. You know, fishing these smaller maps, I thought I would be getting bored really fast. But I'm actually not disliking what I'm doing right now. Take some time to get what you want. But definitely, a step away from the bigger maps, bigger fish, easier to catch, not so bad, man. But these maps are like a once in a lifetime thing, you know. Where you're going to see me go here. Like. A few months apart. Not something every day we're going to be doing this. Gotcha. Oh, 
I want to see a trophy, bro. It's not giving me one. I would go to a bigger popper or walker, but I don't want the guards to be taking my bait. I can try a soft plastic though. <clears throat> Let's try a soft plastic for a minute, like a shadow. Let's go with this one. Event lowers. Nice. So pretty much we got a lot of fish that can go for this. Crappy, bass, guards, pickerels. So let's see if they're going to be uh, feeding today on some soft plastics. Okay, one down. And of course, if I wanted to use the bottom rods for gars and catfish, I would have done that, you know. But I need to have some lower time. Gar fish with no titanium leader. So you can get away with a smaller fish, right? But a unique will break you off, 100%. If your line is weak, a strong possibility that unique will bite you off, bro. <clears throat> By the way, Andrew, what what fish are guys getting over there? Are you guys getting anything to bite, or just uh, finding the way around the map? You know. Here comes our trophy. Don't you dare spit the bait. Trophy? Yes. New PR too, bro. No way. I wish we had more sunlight though. Okay. Let's get some guards now. Since we got the paper out of the way. And for that, smashing out the unique big head and silvers? No way. So, you guys, having a blast then. What about Del, man? Is he having luck? <laughs> what, what's going on for him over there? So he leveled up. Nice. What jig winner should I get or do I uh, get a jester? What pound is the jester for you right now? <laughs> I 
I know I just see one. So, Where well, you just unlock the jester rod. The jig winner 13 pound is good for bass. But do not go for snook, scarpin, or drums with that rod. That's just perfect to get the XP you need for all those fish right there, for the bass fish wise, you know. I think it's 10 or 15. I can vouch for the jig winner, bro. That's something I can vouch for, for sure. Yeah, he's getting them too. He, uh, he just said he needs 56k XP to a level 45. So they get that in two fish from the Congo. Tell him straight up, man. The bank of fishing planet, you know. That's the Congo right there. So far, you guys seem to be enjoying it right now, man. You guys are not complaining or anything that's gonna be like you know bad for the the experience right there let me get back this bait right here with the worm oh damn it come on bro there we go Small mop bass. So you you were like one pounds off. One point two five from a unique right there. Let's try twitching for a minute. I know it says left and drop, but that's because it's on the bottom of the water right now. Still the same thing. A unique gar at the moment on these rods would be pretty nice to fight. But we could also get a catfish to bite as well. By the way, what are you guys depth? For the big head carp and silver. What depth on the match rods you guys using right now? Is there a unique Arapama or just trophy? Oh, we got uniques. Up to almost 400 pounds, man. 395, 385 monsters. But that's in the maze. Amazonian maze right there. 22 inch. So you guys are pretty good then. 15 to 22 inch is good. Sometimes, depend on a leader, you can't go down to 15 inches, you know. Them catfish, bro. Yeah, but I knew it. Once I heard it said 22, I was like, it got to be the leader land, you know. I got you, bro. <laughs> yep. Depending on the leader, you can't... Uh... It also depends on the line as well. I hope you guys get some big 100 pounder, man. I want you all to see the fight, you know. What's this, a gar? Yes, it does.
Hey, yo, team, how many cash do you have right now? How much cash? My bad. I said, how many? How much cash do you have right now on Fishing Planet? I'll do the mix tomorrow because I need to buy a spot rod again and more. It's 21.38 at the moment. I need to go spend time with uh, the wife. You better be good going, bro. Yes, sir. You got to your hands full right there. Fishing. Got some things to do after as well. <laughs> I hope you have enough time, bro. <laughs> nice a unique bass seven pounds still that's a pretty big one trophy wall I give me 400 is a trophy a five pounder or six how long are you gonna be streaming let's see something I would say for the next hour, maybe. Diamond large mop bass number two. Damn, I need one, bro. Hey, Richard, leave one for me, bro. <laughs> leave one for me, bro. I need one. Mine is a uh, 4.4. .4. Still a solid fish, bro. It's a pretty much four pounds. Four hundred dollars right there. So a hundred dollar per pound or per pound a hundred dollars. I don't know. Keep going, bro. So Yami wants to get to level twenty, right? With a reasonable amount of cash, thirty-five thousand to like forty. It's time for a Falcon Lake right there. Eight pound fish, you know. More XP. The cash will not be so uh, so much like walleyes, but really good. And faster bite rates, man. Way faster. Well, do yes, sir. One day we'll pull up and get them all the legend, not legendary. It's diamonds, man. Two different spots. Another trophy. Look at that. Mr. Levi. Welcome to the stream, bro. What's good? Oh, chat. This could be the, the unique or trophy right here. This could be the unique guard or trophy. Don't you dare go over the rock, man. Come on. I don't think so unique. Might be a trophy. 12 pounds, we'll take it. The bridge of all places. We have uh, been sleeping on the spot. The wooden bridge, right? Yeah, I just haven't tried it fully. I've been there now and then. Just haven't spent time there as much. <laughs> Man caught one pound over me, bro. He's like, yep. I beat you, D. Mine's bigger. You, you got it, bro. You got it. <clears throat> caught a 13 pound catfish the other day. Did he keep it or release it? Yeah, I don't know why them got is like that, but he's always going to catch the bigger fish than me, bro. That's them, you know? That's them we got right there. Always want the smoke, man. I don't know why. What's this? Cigar? Oh.
this one's gonna beat you, bro. 13.5, eh. I think my retired or you still beats me. Yeah, I'll beat you, bro. Mine's bigger. <laughs> Mine's bigger right there, bro. Who's gonna break the, who's gonna break the tie? You know? Catfish. Man. So we're not getting plenty of uniques today guys, you know, but still having fun because it's just fashion. You do what you do and you try to enjoy it the best way you can, you know. That's just how it is right there. This is me just casually fashion, not, not a grind for anything, just me playing right now. <coughs> For some reason, these bass are pretty much done biting for me right there. And I know they're here too, man. Just playing past them right now. I'm going to try to spin her bait in a minute. Oh. Was this a catfish or a gar? <coughs> Seems to be a catfish, it doesn't break water yet. Release it cause not a rare catfish like Jerry. So a small catch and release right there. All good man. So how you been Levi? You been good bro? Poor guy got no fight in him. Because of the... The Makans is bottom rod right using man. They got no fight in them bro. Yes, that's good to hear bro. I got my rod now. I got 20k. <laughs> so you're pretty much gonna be spending seven thousand five hundred to go to uh Everglades and then twenty three thousand for a day license. Okay, let's change this bait for a minute. <coughs> Spinner bait's too heavy? Damn. How heavy is it though? One ounce? Yeah, you might snap me, bro. Let's, let's test the waters first. So chat, do not laugh at me if I break this rod, you know. I'm whittling. Not so bad. And with that, we're going to add something else to it. Something extra. So I'm playing the risky, the risky game right now. This thing is already... Let's say... You know heavy enough and we're adding more more to it bro this is gonna be interesting and we got it careful might be a ninja behind you man I'll chop that ninja into two pieces bro 
One for me and one for you, bro. <laughs> JJ, welcome to the stream, man. What's good, bro? <clears throat> What's good? I won't just laugh, I will cry tears of joy. No shot, Yami just said that. You know, Yami, it's good to see you in a good mood today, bro. For, for the first, I will let that one slip, you know? Oh, look at that, it's a plastic bag. Lovely. <laughs> Yo, what? Come on, bro. The artificial minds. I don't know about that one, bro. What's this? Another catfish. I can't see. It is a catfish. Well, see you. Okay, Levi, take care, man. And don't be a stranger, bro. You know? Oh, so you do have trophies in this map. It's been a pleasure as always. Good night, y'all. Okay, Andrew, take care, man. See the next one, bro. Man, go get the hot rod, demigod. Over here, showing off fish, bro. I bet you're not getting no XP for those fish. Maybe like 25 XP. Bass, okay. A unique 20 pounder. Nice. <coughs> nice one, bro. Ah, another snag. What's this, bro? Lovely. What will it be this time? Onward. Man. Trolling right now. Yeah, good night. They need my beauty sleep. <laughs> yeah. Okay, bro. All oh, good, JJ. Thanks for being here, man. You know. Go get your beauty nap, you know. Nice of beauty sleep. No shot. <clears throat> At the fish right there. What float weight should I use for minnows? Mm, which one do we have right now? Damn. Backlash with weed. Just buy the one that's uh, pretty much the last one you have. Yeah, I mean, don't buy the one for Bitcoin, you know. Just buy the last one you have unlocked for you. How many snags am I going to get right now? Nice one. Thank you, bro. <clears throat> and I think by now you might have have a uh, a glow in the dark bobber from doing like regular fishing. If you have one, you can use it. I have to go to bed before my missus wakes up for the night. I mean, I man, you got to do what you got to do, bro. 
you know what I'm saying? Thanks for the help. I won't be able to make it. Uh, I wouldn't be able to make it without you. All oh, good, man. Just as I said, team, just think about stuff before you get them, you know? And before you buy anything in the shop, make sure you have everything balanced out together before you buy something. For example, you want a rod and a reel? Don't buy the rod first or the reel first. Check to see if you have everything to go with each other, you know? Like and sub. <laughs> Thank you, demigod, bro. Hey, JJ. See no evil, fear no evil, man. You know what I'm saying? We don't get scared over here. It's the other way around, you know? That's a garlic. I'm not a fan of garlic, man. Not a fan of it. I see you talking smack today, demigod. Keep talking smack, bro. <coughs> Wow. So now they, they want to bite. This part is not casting too far where I want it to go at. So it's kind of like, you know, letting me down right now. I guess you can skip time. Different peak time I think we should go to right now. Time check. Okay. Damn. We gotta spend Bitcoin. $9,000. XP. Not bad. At least I'm pretty much made back. What we spent to come here. Pretty much right there. Okay, Mr. Early Bird, what will he be? Mr. Gar, good morning, good morning. Nice trophy. Let me go what I told you earlier, bro. Come on, man. See, kids never listen, bro. They just never listen. That's why I don't play with kids, bro. They don't listen. <laughs> What's this? Not oh, catfish, bro. If you notice I did it once to you, bro, just be funny. Then I stop. That's why I don't play with kids, man. So if you get a if you get a block earlier later on, don't blame me. Unfriend you, you know I'm gonna block you, bro. Get you off the list. No more play time for you, bro. You mess around too much. <laughs> I 
I'm messing with you, man. I'm messing with you, bro. Just when it's time, when it's time for streaming, man. You know, don't mess around too much. <laughs> don't don't you dare cry now, bro. See, already crying, you know. No shot, bro. <laughs> okay, uh. I think today will be the last day for me, then we'll take a break guys. Hunter call up to wild, or we'll make it. Ah, something's in my high bro. I'm surprised you're not streaming them, my god. Or you maybe be streaming right now. Catfish, give me a break, man. Come on, bro. Go to sleep. I think if I do get a unique, I'm ending it right there. Unique for the win. I'm surprisingly actually playing right now when it's not kicking you or anything like that, you know. I don't know. Nice one. Man. I got a trophy bass. What are we talking? Five or seven pounder. Yeah, I'm gonna go back to the bass jig. <laughs> Six pounds. That's really good right there. Keep going, bro. And make sure when you catch a unique in the spot, you have another rotation spot to keep farming them. Because it's possible. Nice. I don't think I've caught anything good with that uh, spinner bait yet. It's pure weeds, man. Weeds and plastic bags, man. <laughs> Trolling right now. Uh, let me switch it for the bass jig once more well, let's go three for a minute and it's tilted with every bro can it cast far down yeah When I'm lower fishing, I try to cover as much water as I can just in case I miss a few bites in. Before it reaches me, I will have another bite if that's, you know, the case right there. Water pressure, it's down low today. We got some unique crap today, just not the other uniques yet. I'd like to get another one. <coughs> no team, since it had Everglades, bro, you'll have to stay there for a long time, bro. Because need to make a lot of cash before you leave there. So let's see what you're gonna be doing, man. Let's see how you're gonna make it there, you know. Yeah. 
yeah, I didn't bring the big match rods with me today. Just bottom rods. Nothing was planned, guys. If I had a plan to come here to just reap these uniques, I'll be here doing that. But this is not a planned stream today. Just wherever we go, we get fish, you know. Something different. Oh, did I get a gar? Oh, they go for everything a bass will go for, bro. So just be careful. Most parts going to get in the peak at bass in will have gars there. And even snooks. The snooks can go, come up in the water as well. And go into bass waters if they want. So, you got some things to be careful of, man. I would like to take care of some things after stream, bro. So, autumn finish, let you know. I need to see how Keen is doing. He's been grinding. Yeah, he's been grinding right now. I wonder what level is is uh, is that. <coughs> I got a 15 pound rod. You should be good. Did you bring any titanium leaders with you? Just in case then. Hard. You didn't do that research, but the guard is there. 27. So it was, it was 25 yesterday, I think. 24. And he's up three levels now. Not bad. Still a grand in Falcon Lake, too. You know, he's locked in, man. <laughs> What the hell is it a bird? That is a bird. The perfect bait for a largemouth bass. One swoop and you're done. You guys seen this in chat? I forgot no leaders. All good bro. So when you had to... Uh, <coughs> there's a pickup bass spot, right? I'm not sure what's it called. Oh, you might be there right now. That's where you got the guard to hit. To the far right, be careful. Do not cast that far. There's one specific pickup bass spot there that will get a ton of guards, man. I can't see what spot this though, bro. Now, oh, let me see something. Let me lock in for a minute. What is the name of the spotter hat right now? That's one thing I don't uh, re uh Keep in mind of all the spots in the, the lakes, man, or river. I don't keep track of them. Too many, too many names to remember right there. Handy with a different account. No shot. Welcome to the stream, man. What's good, bro? Floating tickets. Is that the spot I'm thinking of? It might be it.
I can't be sure though. But when I'm mainly getting guards in uh, Everglades, there's only one spot to go for them. If you're, if you're in the one and only spot, just don't cast the right of it, bro. Straight out front of you will be good. So Andy, what have you been up to, bro? You still playing the angler? Should I try the angler, yes or no? That's your call right there, bro. That's your call. There you go. What's this? And he's climbing the rocks again. Wow. Just bouncing down, not dying. What the hell, bro? Let's get closer. We're gonna call that fish Mr. Floppers, you know. He bounced over the rock on the flat surface, spit the bait, then disappear. Nice. Oh, we just missed the fish right there. Another one too. I would like to end it off with a uh, unique smallmouth bass right there. Mr. Shrek. Man's been playing zombies lately, bro. I have Tina Totter on Rebirth Island playing zombies. Keen, welcome to the stream, man. What's good? And Shrek, welcome to the stream, bro. I was down to like play some Rebirth one day, right? Hop 10. I saw you guys grinding zombies. I was like, nah. Let me not play. Let me not mess with them, you know? I play Rebirth too. I want to see what you got, bro. You know? Were you grinding uh, camels or just plain? Hey, Keen, how is the grind going right now? Getting them uniques. Yes, yeah, Freck, I want to see if you can cook in, in Rebirth, man. You know? Leveling up guns. Wait, you play zombie to level up weapons? Hmm. I'm surprised I haven't gone to plunder for that. And it is full for the first time because of you, man. Thanks for helping me out last night. All good, man. So you full that 440 pounds keep that. Damn. How much cash are you talking about right now? <laughs> How much cash is in the net right now? I'm waiting for the day to hand. I mean... You know, you, you can spend one Bitcoin if you want. Just, you know, just think about it. If you want to keep on fishing, you can spend one Bitcoin. Bass are not hitting, bro. I got a little something something. I don't know track. I don't know. From the way you let it sound, man. We should play together sometimes, you know.
I think I might have to. I think I might have a snow car gar on. Just pump and reel, man. Pump and reel, you know. Get him to get tired. To get him faster. Good luck, bro. Yeah, this peak I'm on, bro, is just not hit right now. Hold on a minute. That's the thing I'm looking for right there. Unfortunately, we didn't get to fish it. Oh, we can skip. Nice. Mm, not much cash, but still something to go with. I went from level 25 to 307 in four days playing zombie. There you go. I'll play a, a few zombies there and there. Oh, I hate this bro. I hate when the fish goes over the rock. He got no reason to do that. But I think it was only for fun, you know. I had a friend. I told him zombies not something you should mess with. He was like, bro, I played zombie before, right? So it, it, I went in. I bring him in the, the the zone, the hard zones for zombies, man. Where they can pretty much one hit you. You know. And uh, let's just say he died a few times, you know. He said, I will never play zombies with you again. <laughs> I mean, I warned him, bro. I told him it's not zombies you think you know of. You know, he thought it was easy because he were he was um familiar with zombies way back then, but this MW3 zombies way different, you know. But yeah, he said he's never gonna play with me again, zombies at least. Oh, we had a fish right there, bro. Come on. Honestly, I should be going for crappies too. Yep, call it a zombie. I'm not really a big fan of it though. I never really get into zombies as much, you know. And I think it's because I didn't have the full game when I was um uh, playing back then Dinker don't do it do not do it here he goes So the biggest we got today is a four pound smallmouth bass, unfortunately. We got 12 minutes remaining to get this fish. Something hit it right here. <clears throat> so Keen, where next to when you live in Falcon Lake, man? What map you think you'll be heading to next? It's not time yet, I know that, you know, but where you heading to next? My favorite map I think was on Black Ops, Alcatraz. See, now that one I heard that name a lot of times. Alcatraz, but never played it.
I didn't get a chance to play it, man. Hey, team, what do you mean by that, bro? I don't even know. I want to grind here for a bit, honestly. The only time I should be considering moving from that map is around 35 to 38, where you can get some stronger gears for the bigger fish, you know? Supposed to be fishing, but I'm just watching. You getting bored, demigod? Is it bedtime, bro? So early you said uh, you can't leave views, right? So I'm wondering what you meant by that. You might be in a cooldown, demigod, trying to wait for skip time, you know. I don't know. You can leave us, my bad. Yeah, I might have to take a break in a few minutes, man. But I got you with a Everglades stream one day, you know. Let me go to your bed, bro. Go to your bed, bro. I'm down to do an Everglades stream one day. Could be next week, ne next weekend. But if you guys are around in the, in the week time or the weekdays, we can do the stream as well. I would love to get a PC, bro. That would make streaming more better for me as well, you know. But unfortunately, I'll be in the PlayStation for a good while, you know. But to be honest though team, anything I say to you right now will not be anything bad to help you out to grind, you know. You just have to either take the advice and go with it. Or you can, you know, put advices together and make something out of it, you know. That's pretty much how it is, man. Don't do it. Do not go over the rocks, man. Oh my days. Come on. Get down here. Might be a trophy. Yeah, I will take that, bro. And Keen, if you don't mind, after stream, bro, I'm down to see some sure play if you don't mind, you know. See what you've been cooking lately. Come on, big guy. Take a bite. Mm, not the one I'm looking for, but we'll take it.
I'm surprised these two pounders are hitting the four hot up right now. Like it's nothing to them, pretty much. So let me see something. So we're pretty much gonna be doing a five doing a five hour stream today. I did not plan to be here that long today, man. But that is fishing. And it just happens, you know. It's just what it does. It might be a while I'm kind of still mad about what happened yesterday. Think what's going to happen tomorrow. The thing is, bro. I do think the only way you're going to be able to solve it is tomorrow, man, you know. I know it's going to be in your minds right now. But tomorrow will be the day where you see what's the conclusion, you know. But thinking about it now is only going to make it feel get worse at the moment. It won't make it better, man. But I do understand, you know. I know right now it could be like this for you. You can't wait until tomorrow to make it the final day to see what will be the the conclusion, you know. I haven't even slept yet. No shot. Damn. Yeah, you need some rest, bro. You need some rest, definitely. See, pretty much you can't you can't be at ease because you know you want to get this thing down to to a notch where a decision got to be made or made. So you know what's the next move, you know. I'm gonna try something OP right now, bro. Let me let me get. I hope it doesn't break my rod though. Mm, we're good. Yeah, these damn fish don't want to buy the A4 art hook. Let's go to a 6 art hook, bro. <laughs> I need to go in like a, a few minutes, guys. And we're failing the objective to get a unique. Nice. Maybe I should have brought a bigger bass jig with me. Oh, I had a bite right there. That's good, that's good. <laughs> Not one right there, but I missed it. Oh my days, they're just biting the missing. That's the risk right there to use a bigger hook for a smaller fish right there, you know. Pure biting miss right there. But it's a risk I'm down to take right now. Desperate times calls for desperate measures, man.
Come on, something. Please just take the bait for a minute, bro. Think about it, you know? I love the worm passing by dangling. Look, it's not showing as much. Early morning, you know. Feeling hungry, take a bite. I promise you'll make it count, man. The most delicious worm ever you will ever taste. With something extra. A six out hook. <laughs> Yeah, they're only biting and missing right now. The hook is way too big for these fish. Damn. Well, well, well. I think we might have to take a hell today, guys. Looks that way. It's five hours now. But I won't end it on no bite. I have to catch at least one more fish though. Whether it be a young trophy or unique. I think I might have to go back to the, the bass jig. Today was not the most productive day today, but still a really good day. We get to do something different, try different maps, you know, and a day where I actually get back into Fishing Planet. So I'm not disappointed, not one bit, but kind of let down and not landing the unique way I want today, man. Let's change bait for a minute. And the game is bugged out. The color has changed to darker colors now. Nice. Okay, guys. Last cast right here. I'm going to heat and probably take a nap. You should, man. You should, you know. Get that mind that he's right there, bro. You need some rest. Just shoot me a message. Whenever you're on, you know, and down to chill for a minute. Mr. Bite. If I get on later, I'll message you so we can uh, get some fish. Got you, bro. No rush, though, man. No rush, you know. The game will be here. Just get on when you're ready. Damn, no fish, bro. <laughs> they all biting and missing the bait, bro. This always happens when I'm ending the stream. They never want to give me the fish, bro. There you go. Finally. Who's this lucky guy right here? I'll take a trophy. Don't you dare go around there. Come back over here. Don't do it. Welcome back, team. How is everybody going, bro? Unique. Just perfect. Just perfect timing, bro. Oh my days, man. Just perfect, you know. We pulled up. 
We struggled to get this fish and I'm hopping off right now. We got it. Oh my days, bro. So 288 XP, 551 dollars right there. Not bad, you know. But just perfect timing right there. <coughs> I just got a trophy and one snuck. Just keep fishing, bro, and those uniques will be around, man. I do have videos for all the uniques there, too. So if you want some spots, different baits, and so on, I got you with some videos, bro. Narin River, right? Yes, sir. Not a bad map, bro. But not a map you should really come to grind XP. The cash, okay. For low level, but XP wise, not the best. Could be though. If you know where to farm these uniques, or uh, you got the bass, the crappies, the sunfish, you know. But yeah, that's us right there, guys. Just the perfect fish we want to hand the stream with, bro. We did pass five hours though, but hey, still mission accomplished. What's what's a, what's a more satisfied moment, right there? You know, 13k, bro, easily. Yummy in Falcon Lake, you can make this in one day, bro. Easy, easy, super fast. So as I said, man, not a better map, but a map you can go to if you want. Oh my days. $11,000 to repair everything. Hmm. Wait, did I repair everything? I did. But yeah. We are at the end of the road today, guys. So, you guys have any questions, anything you want up with before I leave today? But let me know. I have something to check in the meantime. What level is Falcon Lake? I think 14. Level 14. Yeah, you can go there when you unlock it at level 14, but it will cost you some money to go there. 4,900, travel cost fee, and the license, damn. Let me see something, bro. One minute. Alright gun, there we go. License two thousand dollars. So two K So five thousand No that's two that's six thousand nine hundred. Yeah. So six thousand nine hundred to get your travel cost license, right? But you will need a net. At least a seven point five Max a uh, single fish and a capacity of like maybe let's see something. I would say 50 pounds or even more if you want to. Keep that. Oh, let's see something 15, 7.5, 55 pound total weight that's not bad right there i had this one before a pretty solid keep net you know i think i'm a far more lies to level 20 you should man that way you get some good things to go with look at this net right there 15 pounds is the biggest fish that you can hold and for the max weight 66 pounds 
right? And for the rise, gonna have some reasonable rise to go to that map. So level 20 should be just good yummy to move to that map. I'm back, Hunter. Welcome back, man. I got 30k. Keep farming, man. Those bass will give a lot of cash right there. Oh, uh, give me a minute, guys. Let me check something. Uh, do crab island. But I know someone has to break the record, though. Yeah, I'm here in this card, right, bro? If you're in this card and any question, be free to hax, bro. Where is that map at? Am I seeing something else? There it is. Bass farming is the worst at low level. I hate it. So when you say low level, what map? Oh, someone broke it. Six to five. Okay. Okay, not bad, not bad. Everglades? Yes, if you go there at low level with the wrong equipment, you will get smoked there. So you have to have a reasonable level to get there, to get fishing. But yeah guys, y'all know what time it is, man. We are going to take a break here. You know what I'm saying? But before that, as I said, if you guys have any question, let me know before I go. If you guys are all good, that's great. You know. Let me check something before I go as well. We haven't been to Rocky Lake in a minute. But Water River. I guess we can try it one day, but not a map I want to go to, you know. But I'm down to go there sometimes. Quanchkin Lake, I'm down to go there. For some massive gar, some catfish. I don't mind, bro. So we got some places to go. Okay, let's not get over our heads right now, guys. But we got more streams to go, you know. Don't lie, you love Mudwater River. Mm, honestly, bro. It's a love and hate relationship there. The map helps me out in the past. To grind snake uh, bow fins, right? But I realized way too late that it wasn't the best map to be doing that. So it did its fair share of leveling me up, but it wasn't the best. It's just the way I look at it, man. Now I know better, I can see what I was doing wrong. Back then, I wasn't even thinking what was the best map. I was on a map just farming, you know. Now I'm more experienced, I could see that we had way better maps to go to than Mudwater River. But yeah, you guys seem to be good. By the don't forget to join the party when you can. Got you, bro. But with that said, though, guys, before I go, I want to say I appreciate y'all who have been here and who's here right now. Dropping a like, sticking around, and just enjoying the stream, you know. Hope you all did. Quick question, the what rod stand I use on the dock? Let me go see what's good in the shop, bro. Not every rod stand can be used on the dock, you know. Tools and equipment. Rod stand. So these single ones right here, the slingshots, they can't hold on the 
the dark. This one is not too bad right here. The duet stand and the mono stand. These ones can pretty much be on the dark, you know. But as you see, they're only one older. They can only hold one rod. This one ain't too bad, bro. So the ones with the stand is good. But the ones that are like the ones you poke in the ground, the dark will not be the best place to go with, you know. So you got the green part, that's is good. You got the wet stand and the mono feeder. These ones are cool right here. Now these ones are the higher tier ones, so I wouldn't recommend them yet. You have to rank up to get these ones, you know. Try the door stand. The door stand doesn't work. Oh yeah? How? I'll be try placing it behind the the dock. I don't have it. Nice. So if it's not working on the dock for you, bro, just place it behind it. But the thing is, every 24 seconds the fish bites, you have to walk or sprint back towards it to get it up, you know. I'm going to just put it on the edge of the dock. And do that you can do that bro let me try something for a minute I could swear this could be in a dock man, but maybe I'm thinking of the other ones, you know. As you see, I don't really have this one. Let's see something. I know you can place it right here if you want to, but you have to run 24 7 back and forth to get it, you know. See? You can place it on here and cast rise out there if you want to, but then you have to be coming from here or here to get the, the thing hanging you know, out, the line. Yeah, that's where I put it. <laughs> yeah, you can't use it there, bro. <laughs> yep. Surprisingly, you can't, you know. I thought this thing was built better. Let me see something. Oh, yeah, you, yeah, you got this time to just stick in the ground, bro. That's why. Yeah, you can't use this here, bro. Rip. Mm-hmm. I think you gotta use the one with the, the legs. Yeah. I thought this had legs, bro. It's a two older rod. Surprise. I'm surprised, man. Yeah, so that's a, a no no right there. So let me see something now, bro. So I think you might have to go level 21. The 21 uh rod older. Right 
broad stand. Yeah, you might have to go with level 21 right here. But the thing is, it's one. You can only put one rod on it, you know. This is two. Yeah. So level 20, you can get this one, bro. The thing is, though, yeah, I mean, you don't need it. These single ones can be good pretty much anywhere you go. It just have to be in like dirt area or between some rocks, you know. So you don't need a, a, a rod stand that's going to be holding two rods or more than two at the moment. Don't really spend your money on stuff you don't really need at the moment, you know. These ones are just okay, bro. You already have this one. And that's good because you can use two rods. So you don't need to buy anything more for this. The map you will be going to, other than this map, will be places you can use this for the older bro. How do you know how far the rod can cast? Pretty much you just have to uh, go to the map and test the distance. But one way you can tell is the length of the rod. So let me show you something bro. So look, this is a 7, seven, seven foot 7 inch rod. Can't really cast too far, right? But this is a uh, 19 point... Damn, this thing is tall as hell bro. This one is not meant to cast too far either, but this one would have been casting way further than the Tropicana because the length of the rod indicates it can cast far as well and it also comes down to the weight the weight of the lower using if the lower is not optimal too light or too heavy it will cast at different depth or distance at some point you know but mainly go with the length of the rod for the far distance casting Because it all counts, man. All of it. But yeah, you know. We should be good. As I said, man, if you have any questions, be free to ask on this card, you know. I will be there, bro. And again, guys, this is it, man. So with that done and said it's ggs baby y'all stay safe be safe and on to the next one peace